Hello, everybody, and welcome to episode 22, 23, 22, I'm pretty sure it's 22, of Red Dead Adventures, here on Off the Shelf Reviews. I am your host, Ian Buckingham, and oh, has it been a day today. It's been a busy, busy day today. It's, what, 8.03 p.m. on Thursday, the 15th of August, and... I've been waiting all day to get on here to do my challenges. What up, Davey? What up, Seed Hill? Yeah, evening time must be a bit different for everybody, you know. It's not nine o'clock in the morning like it normally is. Oh, man, I've been waiting all day. Like, uh, like Thursdays are recording days. Um, so, you know, it was up early this morning. Head over to Gary's place, record a review. Um, but we've got a lot coming on recent, uh, coming on soon. So it was two recordings today, and uh, fuck you, Nella, and and a gaming video as well. Um, so it was just I was I was there, and I'm working with Gary, and all I'm thinking is, man, I want to know what my challenges are. Like, like I need to get home to get my challenges on the go. <laughs> it was touch and go for a bit. I even said to the wife while we were in the car shopping, I'm like, you know, I could just not do it. I could just walk away from it, you know snap of your fingers just turn my back and she said um she went how many days has it been i'm like well 92 93 soon she's like gotta at least get to 100 and yeah i'm like gotta get to at least 100 look at this all oh, right okay oh a bit cold today i'm still wearing my hillbilly gear aren't we dark what is it early in the morning Okay, what we got? A belt buckle updated. Oh, that's easy to do. Drinks ordered at the saloon. That's easy to do. Chanterelle. That's a mushroom. We can find that in Lemoyne. That's that's pretty easy to do. Player kills from cover. That's pretty easy to do. Rats collected. Uh, oh, yeah. I know a place where I can find rats. Showdown series played. Got to play three of them. And a story mission completed. Oh, not a bad day today, really. Where are we? We're in Nook. Bridge. Oh, we head down to Meow. We can get our rat ones already. We can get these rat challenge. Get those rat challenge done. Out of the way. I'll put my. That'll you know make my heart easier. You know I won't be so stressed. Won't do my back no good. Well, like I said, I hope you've all had a good day. You know, been busy down here. We've got our we've got our good friend Nella coming down um, in a week's time for some games, some board games. So we've got to make sure all of our work is done before he comes down because he will shout at us if we're working while he's down and not playing board games. With him. He can be a bit like that. So. <laughs> Predators and signs will be the Yoko Onos of off the shelf. Yeah, I've been getting some hatred for uh, signs recently. Sorry, just sipping up my beer. You know, it is five past eight at night. I can have a beer this time of night. Um, yeah, I got a lot of hatred for signs. Uh, it's a week M. Night Shyamalan movie. And I haven't even seen uh, Glass yet. And I hear that's pretty weak. So, it um, be interesting when I watch Glass to see how that compares up to signs. Whoa, whoa, ambush. Whoa, 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 Jesus Christ. Oh, change that. Where are you? Gun tree. Get to cover. Oh. Okay. Oh, spin around. Oh, okay. Rode right into that, didn't I? I could get my repeater out. I got my own. Uh... Missed you. Of course I did. Of course I missed you. Of course I missed you. Alright, alright. Okay, fellas. And... this. This. There we go. Boys, this is not gonna end well for either of you. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die! Hurry up! Come here! Oh, what the? Why did you duck for? That is not a... Okay. Let's go. Oh shit, there's two guys. There we go. Through the 
trees. Through the trees. Where's the other guy? Messing around these Almost trees. Ah, that beer. That beer's already hit me. Taking it easy. Taking it real easy. That's what gets me killed. Taking it too easy for people like that guy. Oh, yeah. Wow. He almost finished me. He did. He did. He did. That guy did. Oh my god, Ian, stop talking. Signs is good. <laughs> More evening, Silver Spike. Hey, look, I'm not saying Signs is the worst movie. Like, it's no Hellraiser Judgment. You know, don't get me wrong. Hellraiser Judgment seriously holds a, a plateau of shit in my life. Where Signs isn't. It's just... You know... I wasn't expecting an exciting, over-the-top uh, sci-fi action movie. I, kn I know that. I was expecting a story-driven narrative that was just happening at the same time as the Alien Invasion. It's just maybe Mel Gibson and Joaquin Phoenix at the time didn't deliver that to me. Um, to, uh, Mel Gibson, sorry, is he's not very con convincing as an emotionless father, in my opinion. That's just my opinion, and as I understand, we're all entitled to one. Or maybe not me. I don't think I'm. A, I don't think I'm allowed an opinion. But it's okay. I'm gonna take one anyway. <laughs> uh, right. Ah, a raccoon was eating that guy's body. Poor old Gary. You wouldn't let it be, would you, Ian? Look. I can just be very passionate. You know. <laughs> Someone give me a pen. Knife. Also, in my defense, I am comparing Signs, in a way, to other M. Night Shyamalan movies. And can we not also agree that it's not his best? Like, I don't want to say what I think is his worst. Uh, but I definitely think um, Unbreakable is very, very good. Um, Sixth Sense is very, very good. Devil, I hear, is very bad. I haven't personally watched it, but I hear it's not great. Right, rats. I'm getting distracted. I'm getting distracted by movies. I should be on rats. Um, activating posse as well. Posse, activation, go. Reform posse. Head down. Yeah. You have difficulty there, game. You're just going to sit on this screen. Okay. Shut up. Yeah. Yeah, I got just got this menu on there. <laughs> Avatar is clearly the best. <laughs> ah, there we go, man. I, you know, Gary was saying that. Gary was saying to me today. He said, you know, out of all the things about science, he said I won't do Avatar. And I was like, really? He's like, nope. And I said to him, well, would you do Avatar if you had to do um, Don't Mess with the Zohan? And he just looked at me and was just like, why would you do that? Why would you make that even a suggestion? Because I like to think outside the box. Um, mangy brown rat. Do I have to... Do I have to collect them? Just going to put my just rat corpse. Ah, yes, I just have to. And one more. I need one more. One more, senor. Where are the body? Where are the rats? There we go. There's, there's, a, there's a dead one. Yeah, I think we can all agree. I mean, we totally, if we we're going to watch Avatar, we'd watch the animation. You know? Oh. I mean, they really screwed up with that film. What's a cracking Leon? You know, like, I just love the timing of the films coming out together between Avatar, James Cameron's, and Avatars by M. Night Shyamalan. 
Oh, he's going for a little swim. Yeah, this little place up here, this little bat cave, I found ages ago. Um, and it's great for getting rats. 94 days. Great for finding for rats. And great for bats as well. Come on, rats. There we go. Collect me some rats so I can sell them at the butchers. What kind of diseases? This is how you get tuber tur tuberculosis in the game. Just picking up dead rats. Right. Yay, Brinsley! Oh, I've, I should probably wait up here so that Brinsley can get his rats. I don't know if you can... I'll probably head outside so that they can respawn. Okay. Love that little place. Right, well that was pretty easy. I could just do one challenge and then just come off again. What up Paul? What up Brian N? Uh, Brian E, sorry. I have this game lying around for 5-6 months, but seeing you play makes me want to pop it in. haven't played it yet. Hey man, if you want to come and join the posse in the evenings, you know, and or in the when we're on. Get some challenges. I mean, I know you'll be a low level, so you're just starting off. Um, who's that down there? Somebody down there. What's that? Oh, it's a, just an invite. Right, so what we got? I'll go get my belt buckle updated, chanterelle, drinks order saloon. So I can get those two done when I'm in town. That's pretty easy. And get the showdowns done pretty easy. Story mission. So, chanterelle, I'd say, is probably the most next difficult one. In Chanterelle, we would have to head to Lemoyne. Did I write it down in my book of books? It won't let me join the posse. Let me try again. Um, let me check that in a second. Frankly, I'm just on my map. Chanterelle. Chanterelle mushrooms. Aha, uh -huh, yes. See, I, even, I was even very descriptive with it, and I wrote the V in Hanover in Hanover. Right, maybe I need to empty out some posse members. So it's just me. I'm going to send an invite to Brinsley. And then I go to all members and I'll get rid of posse next. Because those guys are just, you know, we get random random guys coming coming in every now and again. Um, kick one posse. Can I kick that guy as well? Oh, it's not kicking either. There, oh, there we go. It's caught up to itself now. Oh, and I see the blunt master across the way. Where is he? He is that direction. Down there somewhere. Bl Blinsley, I will wait here. Oh, you were down by the um, by the beavers where we were a couple of days. Did you all catch the boys? Uh, no, I haven't caught the boys yet. Um... Like I said, I, well, I haven't got Amazon Prime. I do have access to Amazon Prime, but I just haven't used Amazon Prime yet. I'm um, I'm worried, though, because I saw that the Sopranos... Oh, he's riding up here now. Um, I saw the Sopranos, all the seasons, were on um, Amazon Prime. So I was just like, oh, God, I could just get Amazon Prime for that. But then I wouldn't be watching the boys, I'd be watching freaking Sopranos. Which I've watched like a bazillion times. But it just gets better and better every time because fucking James Gandolfini is, is amazing. I know, I know I'd love the boys. Uh, I'd love the boys. Oh, Silver, uh, two eyes, I A I N, please. Come on. Right, you know, I'm not. If I have to, I'll hold a spelling bee for people to spell my name. See, Paul N got it. He, he got it. Uh, right. Here he comes, here comes Brinsley. Right, Brinsley, if you head behind the found the fountain, the waterfall, there's a cave. And in the cave Did you fall in the water? Uh, in the cave you'll find rats. You just need to get three. I'll um I'll get some fishing done here while you're in there. And then wait for you to pop out. Get some rock bass and some bluegill. I'm a crap speller, lol. <laughs> you spelt lol okay. Yeah. It's all right, Silver. Every, everybody gets it. It's just, uh, you know, been been with it like for so many years. I should just, you know, grin and bear it. But every now and again, I'm like, hurr, hurr. the Watchmen series on HBO is kicking themselves. Yeah, see, I was.
quite excited about the Watchmen series because obviously it is set. Um, oh, it's poison. Poison down at fish. You can't seem to catch anything in this pool. It's all poison. Um, the Watchmen series, is this set after the movie? It's like an army of uh, Rorschachs, isn't it? Which I'm like, that that works. I, I like it, you know. I like I like taking the, the story in a new direction. Um, will it be able to compete against the boys? I don't know. Um, but then if I'm honest, I think I kind of lost interest with the boys after I read the second book. Uh, maybe because there was a there was a massive huge turn in the story. I can't remember. Oh, I, I I can't even remember what it is. But at the same time, I don't want to spoil it just in case Barrett get people haven't um, read it. Uh, hey, Adam FN. Um, but yeah, there was just a part of the story where I was like, mm, didn't like that. And to see that it's going to be transferred to TV, um, hopefully they change that. Uh, Gary, you were the bomb in signs. <laughs> yeah, Gary always does it. Right, Brinsley, are you done with your um, your rats? Did you get three rats? Because uh, we got to head to the V in Hanover. Round about here. Above the V, I think it was. We'll get some chanterelle mushrooms. All done, real. Like I said, that's my little spot for finding rats. You can find rats oh, around the front. You can find rats a lot in towns, especially around the harbors. Um, but they're quite scattered. So you see one, and then you're waiting like 10, 12 minutes for another one, and then again and again. Where in the cave you get like five, just running around. You can blast them pretty easily. Chanterelle mushrooms, though. There's some good spots around Lemoyne and around here. But what I found with mushrooms is because they're always stuck by the trees, they, they're very scattered. Oh, there's a stranger. Uh, Brinsley, do you want the stranger? I'm not really bothered about him. I'll cover you just in case he, um, he pulls a gun on you. I mean, we could just kill him if you don't want to do him. Um, but I like I like helping uh, people. Hey, I need some help hey, uh, in he's a in a bad way, Brinsley. I think he's been snaked. Oh, I think I killed this guy a couple days ago. I don't wanna die. <laughs> so, you you gonna help me? Can you? Sometimes they're ambushes. You sometimes they're not. Some you know. I wouldn't ask if I De didn't just depends on who. Oh. If you've interacted with him, or if somebody else has interacted with him. Oh, thank you. Oh, I think he's gonna pull a gun on you. Thank you. You're good for doing this. Is he gonna pull? Oh no, he wants to be saved. Take him to the library, then. You should be fine heading to the grass on your own. This don't feel good. I think he's gonna throw up on you. He's gonna barf. Just don't crash, Brins, okay? It would... I mean, I would find it really funny if you crashed and killed him on the way back, but I think everybody else in the chat would, might, might take a, take a sore side with it. You just head off. Oh, we had the fish. Right, remember, we won't have the fish when we get to Valentine. That's nice. I love that interaction of the game. It's just like, there's a stranger there. Should we interact with him? Yeah, you know. Brinsley needs some extra money, some extra experience. We'll send him off on his own. Turkeys. Ah, uh, just killed two turkeys for no reason. What's that? Oh, it's a snake. Okay, what's that? Okay, Chantro and mushrooms. Violet snowdrop. Nope, too high up. Gotta head back. Head down, down the hill. Chantro mushrooms. 
Oh yeah, it's kind of like a gully down here. I think I've been down here before. It's a bit of a gully. And then there, I said that. Find them situated by the trees. There we go. Oh, that's hummingbird sage there. Fucking hummingbird sage. I could spot hummingbird sage a mile away. Like when you're in certain locations and all you see is this goddamn plant. And you're just like, I'm looking for mushrooms. Not goddamn hummingbird sage. Um, right, what's this here? Okay, creeping time. Oh, there we go. There we go in the background. See those yellow little spots of mushrooms? I'm pointing to my screen like you guys can see me. You can't see me. But yeah, the three little uh, yellow ones there. That's what we're looking for. So I'll get these before Brinsley comes back and steals them. And then help Brinsley find them. Because <laughs> that's what a posse leader does. Deals with himself first and then <laughs> his compatriots. Uh, what's that? That's a fourth one? Yeah, so I just need one more. This is a good patch right here. And we passed the mission. Yeah. Come on, Chanterelle. See, we're, are we close to Le Moyne? Yeah, I think you get like a more of a patch down there. So if we head around this V marker, search this area. Oh, what's that down there? Is that hummingbird sage, oregano, oregano, oregano? I do need to do a drop off to the chemist. Hummingbird sage. Because obviously we've been doing um, quite a lot of. Um, uh, herb contests in the posse recently. So I've just been filling up with so many and then just haven't actually dropped them off. So I will do that when we get to town, actually. Some currants here so I can get some miracle tonics. I don't need any, actually. I am stocked up, am I? I need burdock root and. What's the other one? Where's my satchel? Um, recipes. Miracle Toka, Miracle Tonic is there, and I need Burdock Root and Yarrow. That's why right. Burdock Root and Yarrow. So I'm gonna have to pick up some Yarrow when we head through Valentine. I think there's rat yeah, is that the Yarrow there? Is those plants? Don't think so. Just that over there. Wild carrot, wild carrot. I knew that was wild carrot before I even got to it. Head through here. Hey boss, how was work? I hope the human race weren't too too jerkish today. But they've not been too bad recently. That's how people would react around someone as strong as Superman. Yeah. Oh, oh we're talking, still talking about... Um, we're still talking about um, the boys, aren't we? The Homelander character. Yeah. He is destructive force. Well, him and... Uh, is it Ozymandias? From um, Watchmen. That would be a serious throwdown, I think. You know, it would be quite interesting to see who would win that, that fight. Uh, Huckle, Huckle Bean, take that as well. Chanterelle, I got... I hit those four Chanterelles, but I haven't seen nothing since. Like, I don't know if I've always kind of preferred Watchmen over... Um, over... The boys, I mean, you know, like the boys is good, but is it? It's violent, dark. You know, it's violent, dark tone that sets it about. Where um, I don't know, you know, like in in Watchmen, I really like you know everybody. I don't know if I'm 
not the only one, but like Rorschach is such a great character in Watchmen. Uh, like, I, you know, you have a big thing for superhero characters you can relate to that we are, um, that I don't have any powers. Where I don't, you know, in the boys, I don't think there are, there is anybody who isn't super fucking invincible and hard as fuck. <laughs> you know. I don't know. Like I said, I need to watch the boys TV series to compare it to the hate to the Watchmen live action. But then maybe I'm a bit biased with Carl Urban because Carl Urban is badass. He did do a brilliant Judge Dread. Right, Chanterelle. I'm gonna set the marker for you, Brinsley. Try over here. That's where I just found that four patch. Geese, geese, geese. There we go. Oh, it's American crows. Swear I heard geese then. <laughs> I'm not stuck in here with you. You're stuck in here with me. What he does to that midget guy is disgusting. Never wear capes. I hate the fact that, you know, so many different superhero things tell you different. Like, Incredibles tells us not to wear capes. And, you know, and then Watchmen do and they get caught with capes. And then there's certain people who survive with the cape. Like, Homelander, he's got a cape, isn't he? Um, I'm still looking for Chanterelle. These mushrooms are always the friggin' hardest shit to find. What's that? Ah, here we go. Uh, oh yeah, here we go, Brinsley. I've got some. I've got another patch of uh, Chanterelle over here. I'm gonna pick this one. I could presume I've just done my five. Have I? No, I haven't. For some reason, the game has not caught my five. That was number four. So, that's a bastard. What's that over here? Wild card. Oh, this is the spot we were just over here just a minute ago, weren't we? So that was the fourth one. Wait, no, my mark is up there. Why is my marker all the way over there? Whoa! Whoa! You son of a bitch. Run, you goddamn bloke! Blow you away. Spend so much time in hunt vision that sometimes I actually hear it in real life. I found any up here, Brins? Like I said, I found that four pack, the four patches uh, down here. Do, 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 do. Where was it? I saw the wild carrots. Oh, the wild carrots are over here, so the chanterelle would be here. Well, it was. Ah, here, here is my one. I don't know if it appears as yours for you. No. Yeah. Tell me if it does. It was like right there. Pow. Oh yeah, you got it. You got it. You got it. Right. May just have to come back up to this area in like a day or two when it's when they've respawned. I mean, we, we know where they are, but I just I hate going off and then coming back. I just saw uh, what's that you said, Leon Kelly Lee, OG Bad New Bears, and as soon as I saw that, all I all I read was We Three Bears, We Bear Bears. Sorry, love that series. What's that down there? Chanterelle, boom! Oh, I got another patch of Chanterelle over here, I think. There we go, yeah, I've got a couple. One, two, three. Check over here, Brins. Bring your big ass over here for these mushrooms. We're gonna hit the mushrooms hard. <laughs> I haven't seen a cock that blue and big. <laughs> big and blue since Will Smith played the genie. That was a giant penis, wasn't it? 
Where are you, Brins? There he comes. Well, I can't wait to become a collector in this game, you know, hunting for stuff, heading to certain areas. What do we got? Do you see him down here? I mean, I haven't even picked up the ones that are appearing in front of me, so you should you should see them. Boom. Well, I'm just going to collect the ones. I, I think I like the way that the game has been designed so that we see the patches, but we don't share them. Like, animals are different, but I think, um, I think herbs are different. Is that a bear? I think I just heard a bear. Indian tobacco? That is Indian tobacco. I could spot Indian tobacco over a while. Far away as well. Boom. Did you get them all, Brins? Because if so, we're going to head back down to Valentine. See, I, I picked up mine. He picked up his. So it's like the game registers it as two different. You need one more. Right, okay. Well, there was like a patch of four over here. I mean, I don't know how many you saw. Like, I got that patch of four that we saw, and then, then I, I came down here and found this one, so. Um, we'll search around for some more. American red squirrels. You know what, what, what I could do is make it one of these just to make it really interesting. It's a rough, tough old man's life collecting mushrooms. It is. You know, it it, um, it takes a lot to survive out in the wild. You know, you play Fallout. It's not like that. It's not. It's not as easy as Fallout. I got one herb. Yay! I'm one. I'm winning. I'll go home now. Do, 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 do. What have we got down here? Oh, evergreen herbs. The, these are poisonous. You don't want to ever want to eat these. This is poisonous. Just how quiet it is as well. You know, like we know, like we all know that there's a shit ton of people just shooting the crap out of each other now in the world. You know, robbing and doing story missions. We have to do a story mission, I have to remember. But no, here we are, out in the middle of the woods, just picking currants and looking for mushrooms. What a day. What a quiet, quiet day. I'm just really comfortable. I got my challenge done. Whoa, timber rattlesnake. Where is he on? Up there. Made a run for it. Um, let's have a look down here. See if there's any chanterail by these trees. I've not seen anything. Hello, Mr. Where's he gone? There he is. Oh, that's a good Rocky Mountain for that. Let's nail him with a poison arrow and take his pelt. No, I didn't damage him. That is a three-star pelt right there. I just got to wait for him to die. How does time pass in the game? How do they decide when to change from day to night? Um, oh, it, well, in Red Dead Redemption. Well, there's a timer. Um, so at the moment, it is... 1.06 p.m. in the afternoon. So it has like a day-night cycle, quite an easy day-night cycle. Um, 
Oh, do you mean the mushrooms? No, you can't mean the mushrooms. I'm confused. Huh? There we go. Pick that up. Check down the back. How are we doing with your um, chanterelle, Brinsley? I am not. Oh, yeah, we're still in the middle of a, a herb match, aren't we? <laughs> Totally forgot. Hunting elk and everything. Um, we'll head back to the patch. Oh. Don't see anything. Nothing around here. There's an old man hut over here. This this looks like an extra. This looks like it's part of the um, add-ons that are coming. Like it's just too convenient. Oh, I'm gonna take that meat as well. It's just too convenient to have like a butcher's out here with all of this doing nothing. Take the gin too. You know, they kind of did this with um, with some of the uh, add-ons that they had a couple of months ago. Where there was things just out doing nothing. And you were like, well, what's this for? And then all of a sudden there was people there. Um, there were just new missions added there now. Um, no luck, Brinsley, no luck finding them. No, I think I'm all spent over this side. That's a lot of turkeys. We can always head back up here. Once we've gotten back to town, I mean, you've already got your rat one done, so that's not too bad. And what, you've got three or four chanterelles, so you've only got like one or two to pick up. Take the game meat. You can get game meat from Turkey? I didn't realise. I thought it'd be more like plump, plump chicken meat. Uh, right. Uh, so the nearest place to head to would be Valentine. I mean, Rhodes. Actually, Rhodes is quite close. Turkey. Which was number one? Why are Tombstone Unforgiven? Leon, I saw the words "Why are Tombstone Unforgiven" and thought you were talking about WWE. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I thought the same thing. <laughs> Turkeys! I don't like this right the, the Litchfield up here. He seems to... It seems to take a while to cock it. When he hit, hit, clicks the handle. Um, it takes a while to, to cock it, and then it just... It just seems to fire a lot slower than my Lancaster. Really, really do prefer my Lancaster over I even bought the um, the Evans repeater recently. I thought it would be really good because uh, you're, you, it's the one that you use a lot in the first game. Um, but I you know, obviously I never played the first game like that, so I didn't. I can't tell you if it was a good weapon or not. But seeing it in this one, it took me a while to buy it because my Lancaster was just so good. Uh, what's this here? Um, something just. Some kind of. What's this? Wild carrot, wild carrot. Wild carrot. Nothing, not seeing nothing. Yeah, Brinsley, we'll. You know what? We'll go do a story mission and we'll come back for this. Because it will it will definitely spawn after that. Um, what we got? We got five. Got the chanterelles. Can do that in towns. Uh, let's do a story mission. Oh wait, I oh, know. I've got that elk. I use the poison arrow on that elk. Uh, do I want to sell it? Yeah, screw it. Let's go to town first. Let's head to Valentine. I get. I've got to drop all this shit off now, or I will get distracted and forget. Keeping an eye out for more chanterelle as well for Brinsley. What's that? Nothing? Nope, there's nothing. 
Nothing there. Let's set it to... Boom. Brinsley, get your race on. I'll give you a five second head start as well. Just because I'm fair like that. One. Ah! Oh. oh, we playing like that, are we, fool? You best run. Oh, Christ. Man, I crashed into a goddamn tree. I'll pick up my pelt and everything. Artex. Right, okay. I might have to use my dynamite arrows and cost me $4 to shoot your horse. But that's all fair in Red Dead Redemption. Come on, lasso. Oh, oh, he slowed down. Oh, he swings past them. Oh, tree. Oh, what? Up this pathway. Oh, we're splitting up. We're going two different ways. Man, I can't believe I, you pulled me off uh, my horse. I crashed into a tree and I still managed to overtake you. Come on, Artex. Nobody can beat Artex. You know Artex is like super badass. Um, have you guys reviewed Rad or BMX Bandit yet? Nope, not yet. I don't think we've reviewed anything with them. Um... Oh god, I was going to say Lisa Kudrow then. No, it's Nicole Kidman. Lisa Kudrow. I could do with some Yarrow actually before I head back to town. Mm, head through the heartlands and pick up some Yarrow. Uh, no, we haven't done any. Uh, we haven't done BMX Bandit yet. Or, or, like I said, nothing with um, nothing with Nicole Kidman. In. I keep thinking Lisa Kudrow for some reason. Um, right. What are we looking for? Yarrow. Common bull rush. That's Brinsley. Brinsley, what are you doing? Come here, Brinsley. Oh, gotcha! Yeah. I am always in that. Uh, as everyone can hear, my wife is in the background. She's coming to uh, join us. She can pull up a chair, dude. Sit down. All right, you're going back in to, to finish off um, Master Chef. Yeah, Master Chef Australia is on at the moment, and we're big into uh, Master Chef Australia here. Uh, so who, get, who got kicked out? Oh, Yasher was doing quite well, actually. Oh, Yara. I'm going to get this Yara actually wrong. Oh, yeah, I didn't know. She was, um... Oh. Yeah. Third one in... Well, you know, it happens. Sometimes you just end up just losing really, really quite easily to... Or is it a good dish or a bad dish that took around? Yeah. white chocolate mousse kind of failed did it mm. yeah, you got that you gotta have that time oh I got Lee is that is that Lee I think uh, I think Lee has just signed on I I accidentally um, I accidentally did um, make Lee leave the um, posse a couple days ago I it was by pure pure accident I was going through the posse I was clearing people out and then I accidentally uh, deleted Lee from the posse and I was like ah oh, shit I'm going to have to wait for him to come on so I can message him again. So, uh, yeah, my beer is halfway through, so you might have to just put the other one there just so I don't have to get up. Just to make it easier, so. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I haven't told him what review we were recorded, obviously. No, 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 though we can't. You know, could be anything. Could be, could be Western, could be, um... Could, could be horror, you know. Could be, could be anything, dear. You know, you, people don't have specifics today. No. Obviously, we try not to give too many spoilers. Oh, come on, Brinsley. I can't win this race. I can't. Uh, you know, that was, that was that was fun pulling you off the horse, but you need the experience. So I'm just gonna park myself. Up about. Where's the marker? The marker is about here. Almost in town. Look at this. Artex is just taking a gentle ride up to the top of town. 
the top of Mount Dunn. There he is. Here he comes. Here he comes. He's punishing that button. He's punishing his horse. <laughs> nice. Good good race, Princey. Good race. That's a, an elk pelt. We were hunting for herbs earlier, and I just saw a three-star elk. Killed it with an arrow, poison arrow. Where can I get some money? Whoa, that guy's a red. What color is it? What level is Mr. Red? Come on, players. There we go. Oh, he's a level 25, the guy who's walking there. Level 25. Level 25, and he's already caused some trouble enough that he's a red character. Okay, Mr. Butcher. I need to sell some stuff. Okay, Brinsley, if you shoot that red guy, that's completely up to you, but um, try not to. Seems everyone with a rifle been hunting these. Like, I'm fighting the temptation to attack that level 25. Simply because this he's, you know, fella been torn up. Drops the price. He's, le he's, tw he's level 25. Not my fault. Um, okay, so that. Seems everyone with no, they all look the same. He has he has not left this stand for about Treat six months. With respect. And yet, I, he never remembers my face. Like, he always... That's true. Right, okay, sell my herbs as well before I go. You should probably sell yours as well, Brins. We've got a lot of money. Who's that? Is that... Oh, you killed! Oh, you killed that guy, did you? Will you move? Like, he's just, he's just chilling in the sun. Look at this guy. Oh man, how do you get a ten in Red Dead Redemption? Well, I use old pig fat to rub. He's still alive. Really don't want to get involved. That guy's still alive. Are there a few films in your series you're reviewing for Halloween? Uh, no, we're not doing a Halloween series this year. You're going to get the law on you. Gary and I both came to the conclusion that, you know, what's the point of, you know, people don't find horror movies scary anymore, you know, there's just, there's just no point to them. First time? Oh, a whole series of Adam Sandler, for, that would be Gary's horror. No sick, you chew too much. That would, he would, Take as much as you need. He'd, he'd kill himself at the end of mm. each one, you know, and then I'd have to bring Kate. him back to life and then make him sit for another one. <gasps> that could okay. be a theme. I'll buy that. Wow, this is a lot. Look how much money I've got here. Thanks. How much? Uh, One thousand and thirty dollars. That's a deal. It's been a while since I've had over a thousand dollars. I work hard for this uh -huh. money, God damn it! It's hard living in the wild west. All right, I'll take it. Uh -oh. Sure. Mm. I bought some, um, but mm. I've mainly got the main sure, okay. outfits I've got. I usually right. just save all my money and gold for That's rare stuff deal. that pops up. You know, when Thanks. Rockstar says, "Hey, look." Here's some limited edition trousers. Right, I should actually it. check them while I'm here, actually, just in case. Okay, I'll One thousand and fifty. It's a shame you can't give any money to your posse members. Sure. Because I would actually spread the love. Um, well, I'm gonna loot this guy while I'm here because he's been shot. And I'll loot that body of that. You know, there's just there's no point just leaving money there. You left a wee hint in one of your other reviews, if I'm not mistaken. No, there are no hints. We've done no. We're not doing. I told you, we're not doing any horror movies this year. You know, um, if anything, we're you know for this Halloween we're doing the Look Who's Talking series. So. What the hell, man? That guy's bought himself a new pair of trousers to start a fight. Oh, he's gonna get himself. Uh, can't just leave this money lying around, Brins. I mean, jeez, this is this is good money just going. Oh, silver emblem ring. I do want it. You know what? You know what? Can't help myself. Can't help myself. Come here. Come here. He's inside, man. Get inside and drag There we go. <laughs> I'm just gonna hog tie him. Oh, that's the level 25 he was causing yeah. trouble. But I'm just gonna hog tie him and then I'm gonna run next door because he can't attack me. <laughs> I want to go to the general store. Damn yeah, and kill him. Could have shot him. You knew in town? Could have, would have, should have, but I didn't. No horror movies for Halloween, and we Where fucking riot. Right. <laughs> well, you'll have to speak to the boss because it was Gary's choice. Gary was like, "Nope, nope, no horror movies this year," and I was like, "You sure?" And he was like, "Nope." I, it's it scare it scares me too much, Ian. I I can't can't live with the nightmares anymore. And I was like, "Okay, that's your choice," you know. Ooh, have I already? I think I've already got that one actually. I bought that one. 
Yeah, but with the black and red one. Mm, nothing. Nothing. Got most of all this. Yes. Oh, shit. <gasps> Brinsley. I think we're going to have to... Um, oh, Anastasia. Yes, I need to... Um, sorry, what was your message again? <laughs> Totally forgot to read his message. Uh, hey, um, if mind if I join you guys? Yeah, come right in, Lee. Seriously, um, I should, I should leave here. Come get Lee in, and then shoot that guy in the face for hog for killing me. All right, have a think about it. Totally my fault. Totally my fault. I did hog tie him. Um, posse, invite, and uh, there, there you go. Right. Where is that level? Where is that guy? I'm gonna mess this guy up. Nobody shoots my posse members. Only I can shoot my posse members. Huh. Go. Oh shit, he's up time me. <laughs> he was behind the door the whole time. The sneaky bastard. Oh. He's like, you know, he's gonna kill me. Is he gonna kill me for it? Yeah. <laughs> Tied me up and shot me in the face. That's what you get well, it happens. But now this guy's just gotta get messed up now. Like, like I have to get him now. You know, he he knew when you're a red target, you're gonna draw attention to him yourself. If if he was blue, there'd be no trouble. But he, right, where is he? But I saw the red and. Well, I just went straight for it, didn't I? Like a like a bull in a china shop. Uh, let's change to that. I don't want to change my lich field. Who's that? That's uh, Blunt Master. Yeah, come on in, Blunt. Let's go get him. <laughs> we should be doing challenges, but no. I'm getting fully distracted. I, I always get distracted. Who's that? Is that Anna? Target him. Can't target him. Because he's in defensive mode. He is in defensive mode. You can't target me. Oh, yes, you can. There you go. You start. If you're in defensive and you attack another person, your damage. Um, <laughs> my favorite part is Linda laughing at your death. Thanks, Grace. Um, if you're in defensive and then you attack somebody else, you will do less damage. Oh, you son of a bitch! Because you attacked somebody else. Yeah! Man, you messed up. You're against the banditos now. Who's that? Who's that? Oh, no, no, don't, no, that's, that's Lee. That's Lee! Oh, shit. You just shot Lee. <laughs> that was Lee. Lee, I did send you an invite. I, I did send you a posse invite. To you. I'm going to send you another one. Um... Oh no, he's locked at the moment. There we go. Invite. There we go. Sent you another invite. Oh! Shot the face. He hit me first. <laughs> he did. I don't think he realised that he could. Um, he could attack you. Hey, Chris. Yeah, getting fully sidetracked. Now I've got to pull out my explosive arrows. Like. Like, I didn't want to, but they're in my hands now, so somebody's going to get blown up. And then we'll go on a story mission, I promise. Where is he? He is. Oh, shit! Artex just fully took me out. My own horse attacked me. Like, cause he, oh, cause it's because I asked Artex to come forward so I could get some weapons. Uh, come on, Artex, get here. It's t we've turned Valentine like we rode it to Valentine. We've turned it into a turned into a war war zone. Um, no, don't want that. Oh shit! Well, that's what happens when I'm sitting there changing my uh, weapons. Right. Okay. This level twenty five. I think he's I think he's had enough fun now. Uh, Anastasia, are you having trouble joining the posse? Posse join failed for some reason. Okay. Let me. Let me check. Did it get rid of a couple more people? Oh, maybe camp? Might have to set a large camp to get more people in. 
get into the heartlands. There we go. And go to posse, posse members. Uh, yeah, it should be enough space for you to join now. Invite to posse. Anna Shana Shana. Yep, you already got an invite to you. Right, now I'm going to go fuck this guy up. Uh, express rounds, yes. He's up on the second floor again. Hiding on the second floor of the hotel. Right. He is waiting for me again. He well he knows he, he it's standard deathmatch, isn't it? He's just died. He's either died or he's left them out. No, he's still he's still here. He's just not in that area anymore. He must have got killed by the cops. Because obviously causing trouble, he's put the cops on himself. Oh, nice, my master. Nice shot. Alright, come on now. can I send? Oh, watch out for the cops. Can I send now an invite to? Right, there we go. I've sent you another one. I think we need to leave now, Brinsley. Well, these cops are going to cause a lot of trouble, and we're going to get caught up in a gunfight with a bunch of other people while also trying to deal with the cops. And it is weirdly glitching all over the place, too. Oh, and we just bought the light. Always love the light. Look at that. Death and destruction to this town. Where's that? That's that. That little red guy, little bastard. There he is. Oh, he's getting he's getting murdered by someone else. Somebody else just murdered him. <laughs> God, that guy just murdered him. Like, well, I had nothing to do with that. I was gonna come and kill him, but he was killed by somebody else. So that that's that's down to them. Um, I I, I can actually do that actually. Where is his body? Oh, he's down there. There's his body. If I put my gun away. Oh, put your gun away. No, put your gun away. And then go. <laughs> you gotta love me, you <laughs> Um. Who's that? That's proper. Whoa. Whoa. That's what you get, Xerox Ghost. That is what we call an explosive round. That is almost a thousand dollars. Oh, motherfucker! I could have a posse pew, but I don't have a posse pew. Brunsley, I've started a posse feud. I know we should be leaving town and going on a mission to get stories. Yeah, I've done, I've done two challenges. I've got two challenges done. Uh, Runny... Whoa, he, oh, he's a level 20. Man, you... Right, we've got a posse challenge on the go. Or will be on the go. Artex, I need my Lancaster and I need my bow and arrow. What? Oh, my, oh, my guns. Oh, I can't. Oh, I just cracked my horse into somebody else's horse. Um, well, in the satchels. He's like, how can you kill me? I was in defensive. Explosive arrows. Boo. This guy's going to get it. Like an avenging angel of death. Oh no, is he leaving town? I think he's leaving town. So I'm going to go get the posse leader. Because he pissed me off. Always check your player list. Do not ever attack anybody. Just... Oh, he ignored it? I'm going to ignore this arrow to the fucking face when I find it. Check the posse list, see who they are, when they are high level and you can recognize them. Then... Boom, bitch! Get out the way! That cost me four dollars. Okay, let's go, Brinsley. Let's get out of town. Time to leave. Um, Lee, if you can, if Lee, if you're still in the group, stay with us. Oh, look, train is just here. Let's take the train. That's good timing. 
Uh, Lee, yeah, I will sort you out an invite huh, as soon as I got a chance to stand still. Well, yeah, you, like, uh, it takes a lot of effort to get on this train here. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta role play. You gotta be in the moment. You gotta be in the character. That's why I keep coming back. So that's, that's why I can't get enough. Uh, right, okay, I've sent you another one, Lee. Anat Satsusha. Are you such a weird name? Anat Satsusha. Level 20, level 29. Oh, man. Those are some low... Oh, oh, who's this? Is this... I hope this is Lee, because I'm about to shoot this guy in the face. <laughs> like, whoever's coming up the train. We're checking the map. Uh, proper Cobra. Proper Crow over 2014. Maybe it, that's fine if they we are being followed. See, Brinsley thinks the same thing. He thinks we're being ghosted too. So let's just let's just check see what level he is. Oh, he's a level 17. Okay. Maybe he's fine. There's a there's a smoke cloud in the background if we want to go for that. If he pulls his gun, he's the dead man. world that we live in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, I didn't tell Brinsley to do that. Brinsley's doing that himself. He has decided to... Oh, this guy may fall. The rules of the posse is you start a fight and you need backup, that's fine. But if you start it, you, you have to handle it. That's fine. He hasn't pulled his gun. That's a good thing. The guy hasn't pulled his gun because he knows there's two of us. So, um, so the, the invite's still not working, Lee. Um... Nope, you still, you've still got it coming. The invite's still there. The stars are, Like, that guy is the highest, I think, in the whole map. 332. Nope, 364. Is that 304? 364? That's quite high. And everybody else is still quite low level. I was going to tie him up and throw him off the train. Yeah, we know, Brinsley. We were watching you. Um, you know what? Brinsley, we have to go back to Valentine. We didn't get no drinks at the saloon, and I didn't even change my belt. So that's two challenges that we didn't even do. Hey, uh, uh. So I'm coming kind of back to Valentine. <laughs> because I need to. <laughs> um, and then what we could do is we could actually, uh, once we finish now, we could go onto a story mission, and then once it's gone into a new server, um, then I could send, try and send Lee another invite to see if it will work. Um, I swear I just saw a gun. gun black. Oh wait, is that Lee joining? Not joining? I swear I just saw the flash of it. Invite to posse. I'm going to try another invite to posse. It, it popped up. Like I saw a second blue marker pop up at the top of the radar map, and then it disappeared again. See, it's just it's done it again. So there is something, yeah, something weird going on there. It's like he's accepting it, but then the server seems to be kicking him back off. Right, okay. What we'll do is we'll do a, a... What's this guy? Who's that? I get real paranoid when somebody comes right up to me. Uh, I had the same issue when I was trying to join you, Ian. Yeah, and then you managed to join. Who's this? Oh, there's Lee, actually. Hey, Lee. I won't attack you. The smoke cloud. There's a camp up here that needs rescuing, so... I, there's, there's a camp! It needs rescuing! If I don't rescue it, they're gonna get killed! So, I will I will definitely go there. I will go there, I promise. I just... You know, people moan at me when I do bad things, and then when I do good things, they moan at me still. There we go. There we go. Thanks, Artex. Oh, did you get killed, Lee? Oh, well, we need to get you right in the closet. That's what we need to do. Maybe, um... I don't know if it will work if you join another server, Lee, and then I send you another invite from there. Oh, Christ. Oh, Christ. Shouldn't have stood there. Oh, 
Deserve like a bullet, but I just I just felt like firing from the hip. Uh, what did you say then? And uh, 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 I'll try that. Uh, yeah, try that, and then I can send you another one. Um, we'll head to Valentine, get our two challenges. Uh, we will head um, into a story, get that done, and then we'll try and obviously get you in because it is usually all the time. Whenever there's issues with connections and things like that, it's usually just something to do with a server issue. Like, I don't understand the whole technical stuff behind it, but then when you refresh it and then all of a sudden you, you you can just join in and... Is it my end? Is it your end? Is it Rockstar's end? There's a lot of ends in, involved. I know I'm getting distracted looting these bodies. Don't, honey, don't judge me. My wife is judging me now. <laughs> uh, right, can I... Right, he's not on there, actually. So have you just did you reset did you try reset your Xbox or did you just try it go to a different server? Where's what's Brinsley doing? He's all the way. Right, Brinsley, head to head to the saloon in Valentine. We'll get drinks and change our belt buckles. Because that's what we need to do. Gonna turn in guys, have a good one. Take it easy, boss. Hard day at work. You put your feet up and chillax. I'm not drinking while on the job. <laughs> Sorry, it's just a alcoholic joke there. Yeah, you might have to bring in my second beer, actually, dear. It seems to be running down now. It's the heat. It gets a bit hot in here when the doors are shut. <laughs> I have opened the window. I'm just using it as an excuse to drink more beer. <laughs> right, okay. Belt buckle. Belt buckle and... Drinks at the saloon. Get completely distracted. You're heading back to my ship now. Cool. Alright, love you, baby. She's gonna head back to her master class now. Basically, for those of you who don't know, in um in in obviously Master Chef, they have these master classes with particular um Particular skilled chefs, you know, and the chefs show them different abilities so that they can apply it to the next load of uh, challenges that they need to do. Um, and at Satya, I've joined another server. Okay, so if I invite you to game. Oh, Bluntmaster killed another guy. If I invite you to game. And then, can I find you? Oh, because you're not a posse member. Because I freaking did that stupid thing. Posse members. All members. No, you're not on that list. Current members. No. Is there a, is there a fight in the middle? Oh, there's a fight in there, isn't there? Oh, I'm coming, Brinsley. I'm coming. We might have to go to another saloon. As soon as he comes down the corner. <laughs> Wooly Barber, what's what is what is your your level 32? Okay, Wooly Barber, if you come to me, Brinsley, go get your drinks and get your challenge. I'll cover you in the saloon. Because if the two of us get, oh shit! Whoa, <laughs> man! Damn, you got your. <laughs> You got your head blown off. I just watched you dro get dropped in the middle of the street. Damn. What's the other guy? He's a level 16. Okay.
Alright, I need to get revenge for Brinsley. Alright, go Brinsley, go get your drink. Ah, oh, shit, I got cops after me now. Go get your drinks. I got you covered. Certain part of people. You got your drinks? Okay, cover me while I go get mine. He's coming through the back door. Is this guy coming through the back door? Watch him. Yeah, you got him. You got him. Uh, Mr. Bartender, I need five drinks, please. Wow, we have never really drunk like this under pressure, have we? It's usually just a case of, let's walk in the bar and get drinks. Uh, Chet, watch the red guy on the street. He's only a low level, but I've killed him a couple times and he'll be pissed. Whoa, man. Don't do it. What's this guy doing? This is how the posse does This is how the posse does it. We drink under pressure. You know, we come into a town and we make it our town. Unless there's more of you, and then then we don't, then we leave it. Okay, I got my challenge. Here we go. Right, posse. Uh, invite to posse is Anna. Anna Sena, part of the idiot. No, he's not yet. Oh, man. Okay, drop the drink. Ah. Fucker, motherfucker. Double barrel shotgun to the back. I mean, I've got my drinks now, so all I really need to get are my... is upgrade my belt. Where are you? You're at the back of the store, aren't you? Where are you? You're gonna kick me, this game's gonna kick me in a second. Either the game's gonna kick me, or this guy's already left the server. Because I'm running fine, and everybody else is running fine, but we are not hurting this guy. I mean, I can last him, and I can hogtie him. See, everybody else can see him as well. This <laughs> is like four of us. Whoa, what are you doing? Okay, reacts news. Oh, I've just killed my Xbox. I killed my Xbox in that. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, Lane. Um, I'm in the middle of, of uh, restarting my Xbox at the moment. So um, I'm sorry if some of you are obviously looking at the screen like, whoa, Ian, what the hell? So I'm just going to... Uh, I'm just going to close that one for a second so you can't see that. Yeah, that did not sound good, did it? Like like I said, I saw that guy and I'm like, you know, there's a there's something wrong there, you know? Um, I could, uh, should I, should I? Uh, do, 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 do. I should really just, uh, okay. Everybody look away now. Because I'm just gonna do, 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 do like that. None of you saw that. You can't you can't see that. That's just how quick that was. I could stop streaming, um But it's um it would take a lot of effort. <laughs> but that killed my Xbox. Literally, that guy, I was stood there, I was shooting that guy, we all were shooting him, there was like four or five of us around him, and then <laughs> We're all dead. I'm, well, I'm gone. Brinsley's crashed as well. As well. 
so yeah, it it just it it killed all of our Xboxes then. I got my drinks. <laughs> oh, best open my other one. I think the server was messed up because we all crashed at the same time. Yeah, well, we did say, didn't we? I mean, you weren't able to join at the start. Lee was having trouble joining as well. Um, I was surprised. I, to be honest, I was surprised the server lasted as long as it did, really. Um, because I was I was noticing glitches when we were running around Valentine. I was like, this, this isn't right. And then when I was shooting that guy and he was not dying, I'm like, yeah, this is, it's either going to boot me in two seconds or, and then, whoop, dead. But hell, what are you going to do when you're running a massively huge online serving game? You know, you're going to have some technical issues. Hopefully we get Lee in, Lee in as well. We have to head and get your Chanterelle Brinsley. Get that one finished. I used up explosive rounds when I should be saving them for friggin' showdown series. <sighs> I, I get distracted. I'll be right back while it's loading up. Yep, run back. I, I could as well, actually. I could pop outside for a, a cigarette. But I'm not going to. I'm going to stay here with you guys, because I love you guys. You're my pu you are my posse. We are the banditos. Every one of you is a deputized bandito. It might be the second beer talking, but, you know, it's fine. Yeah, so this year's um, Halloween um, movies. Yeah, they're all just Adam Sandler movies. Like, um, Gary decided... That he, Gary op openly admitted to me that his view on... Um, on Adam Sandler has completely changed. You know, he just... He's going to hate me for this. <laughs> he, he loves Adam Sandler so much. It's just like his new top star. Smoke him if you got him, Ronan. No, it's a lie. Gary hates Adam Sandler with a passion. Like, he hates Adam Sandler. Like, I kind of dislike signs and... But deep down inside, he would watch certain films over certain things. Like, like I think he would actually watch The Predator over any Adam Sandler movie. Even though he hates The Predator. But then I think he would actually watch any Adam Sandler movie over Cabin Fever. Because he absolutely hates Cabin Fever. It's a weird kind of domino effect. Right, come on game. Taking a while to load up. Is it because I asked you to load up the passy? Yep, yeah, Lee's loading up now. We're all loading up now. Glad I got my freaking first two challenges done. Maybe, and I'm just spitballing now, but maybe it's the start of the server update. Maybe some of the glitches and some of the issues that we're having are, are the, the precursor to the new update coming. You know, I, know I, I sometimes notice that with games when like it's doing really well and then sometimes it starts to have issues and then all of a sudden a new update uh, drops and patches all of the stuff that you have issues with. But then I'm sat here waiting for it to load and I'm like, Jesus, I thought we were in the era of not really long loading screens I thought I left all that when I left my Commodore back in the day oh music's changed so it means it might be loading in now 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 yep yeah, I'm just waiting to load in Lee as you can see oh as you can see actually you know Big black screen with nothing. There we go. Wow, where are we? Well, we're in New Austin. Jesus wept. New Austin. Posse. Invite to Posse. Um, okay. Who's on? Right. I need to send one to... Anasana, 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 
I need to send one to him. Oh, invite to a game. Invite sent. Um, Bluntmaster, you're not on my list. So, posse members, current members. There you are. Ah, there, yeah, there you go. You are in. And Bluntmaster, invite to session. You sound like the aliens from our attack. Ah. I watched that recently. I uh, watched that a couple of weeks ago, and man, that movie is still freaking awesome. It is the movie is still brilliant. Yay! What up, Lee? There he is. What up, man? <laughs> like, okay, Lee. I just got to check. Are you a guy dressed as a woman, or are you a woman, like? That I just, in, you know, just envision as a man because your name's Lee. Like it's cool, like if you're either. I just, I just want to check, you know, because, because then I, you know, I don't, I won't feel bad when I do that. <laughs> Yo, yeah, I'm a dude. Okay, that's fine. So this is just like this. Yeah, this is cool. Oh, there's a hideout nearby, Lee. Right, sorry, I'm gonna cut you free, and we're gonna go do this hideout. Get your little cute jean ass moving. You got work to do, girl. Alright, we need to send one to Bluntmaster as well, don't we? Posse, uh, invite to Posse, nope, not invite to Posse, Posse members. Bluntmaster, select, invite to session. Great, now Lee joins, but not me. Yeah, I know, I'm just, I'm, tr I'm clicking on invite the session, but it doesn't, it says I need to join the session. Okay, what I may do then, once we've done this hideout, Oh, we have to go. F I hate. I hate this one. It's always down in the quarry. What we'll do is, I'll s drop the posse after we've killed this hideout, and then we will invite you back in. Right, I've got you covered, Lee. If you want to ride, ride in. I got you covered. Where is it? Boom, motherfucker. Oh, that. I felt that. I felt that enter his nose. Like, that, this guy's gonna get it. See? That guy's dead before he got up. Oh, motherfucker. Oh, in the gut. That guy felt that one. Oh. He's still alive. Oh, through the chest. Uh, oh, there is one. Winged him, I winged him. That one got him. Oh shit. There's somebody down there. Where is he? He is. There he is. Hold still, hold still. Will you hold still so I can shoot you in the face and kill you? Oh! Through the hat. Alright, where is he? There he is. Bang! Oh my god. Nope, missed again. Oh, he's dead that time. No, there's another guy. Where's the other guy? He is just by these rocks. Down there. He's supposed to be down there. No, he isn't. He's more... That angle. Behind that rock? No, you got that guy. You got him, Lee? You got him? I can't get a shot from up here. Oh, there it goes. Oh. Shit, I killed the leader. I hope we weren't trying to keep him out. He got his shanter out. Yep, get your sh Yeah, you get, one, you get one challenge while you're doing the other one. Um, right, okay. Right. Let's see. No. If I can. Let's see. Can't do it while we're in the middle of a abandoned hunt. 
That's fine. Lee's got this. Shane, almost everybody's dead. I don't see anybody else. There we go. Right out clear. I'll leave all the bodies for Lee. Lee can get all the. Lee can have all the cash. I'm good. Um, right. Invite to posse. Can't. No. Not invite to posse. Posse members. Blunt master. Invite to session. But I can't do that. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to stand down the posse. Count to 30. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. And then, try to start up the posse again and send out invites. If not, I may, ha I may have to join a new server and then get the guys to join along with me. But, I don't want to do that. So, reforming posse. Game just takes its little sweet ass time doing its shit. See, now this, like I noticed this earlier, didn't I? You know, when I was reforming the posse before, that it was just taking a little while longer than normal. Which is a bit weird. There we go. Right, okay. So, posse members. Let's send a... Like... Yep, yeah, I, can, I can't invite you. But I can invite... Nope. No. Nope. Right. Okay, what I'm going to try and do... What I'm going to do is I'm going to find a new server. And then I'm going to invite you guys back in. So, I'm going to hit the free roam. Give myself a new server. What up, Matthias? Um, and then I'll let's see what happens when I invite you guys in. Like, I've met... Oh, I should have made a big camp. That's what I should have done. No, because that's what I did before with Lee. It was... Yeah, and that didn't work. I can hear the fireworks. We've got down um, down in the southwest at the moment in Plymouth. We've got our um, annual yearly firework competition going off. Um, because they always hold a firework competition every year in the middle. So that um, at, in November when we have fireworks night, whoever wins... Um, Whoever wins obviously throws off, shows off their firework performance, and you can just hear it. We we live, what, thirty minutes away from where they're actually thirty to thirty, thirty to forty minutes away from where they're actually showing the fireworks, and we can hear it outside like it's like it's right outside. Obviously, you can't see them, but you can hear them. Crazy. Yeah, Lee, Rockstar servers are the best. They are the best. Rockstar, you know, we are talking Rockstar here. You know, Rockstar servers are some of the best well-kept servers in the world. The one that doesn't blow his hands off wins. What they do is they do it out in the middle of the um, they do it out in the middle of the water. It's you know the the local ferries make a shit ton of money from ferrying people out into the uh, into the um, local harbor. And then you can sit on the boat and have drinks and then watch the firework display. They they make a heck of a lot of money from that. Right, as you can see, I am just reforming the posse. But at, uh, once again, it's taken a while. <laughs> Katy Perry won the fireworks last six years. Yeah, as soon as she opens her top and they just all come spamming out. like psh, psh, psh. It, Sex with her must be really difficult. Um, right, okay, posse members, Bluntmaster, let's invite you, no, okay, let's try joining your session instead then, okay, I can't invite you, but I can join your session, this happened last time, didn't it, I bet I joined his session, and then he disappears, and I'm stood there on my own looking like a fucking pleb. I mean, that would be a bummer, but then if that... 
if we have to do this challenges separately um, then I'll just help you find the ones that you're, you're I think we found most of the ones that we needed to do the chanterelle ones I knew were going to be most difficult uh, unable to join failed to retrieve session day to details from the target player okay I think Brins you might need to restart your Xbox maybe I don't know I don't want to say you have to um, why won't it allow me to go into the posse posse members yeah because um, if I can invite Lee yeah so I've just sent Lee I formed a posse straight away and you know, I think the issue might be on your end well I've just sent an invite to Lee so I'm just gonna see if Lee can join See, but I, I mean, you, you say it's mine. I like, I, like, you were in the posse with me. <laughs> you were in the posse with me, so like, it was fine. And then Lee was having a problem. Uh, Lee's just joined the posse again. Um. So yeah. So, <laughs> you sent one to Lee as well. Yeah. See, there's Lee. Hey, Lee. Hey, Lee. How you doing? Yep. And both me and Lee have restarted. But you, you, you restarted as well because we crashed. I'm going to try again. Uh, nope. Posse members. Bluntmaster. Invite session. No. No, 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 no. Right, okay. Well, while we're waiting for Brinsley to see his stuff, I'm going to quick join a story so we can get that challenge done and keep uh, Lee's hands busy because obviously everybody knows that Lee is very aggressive if he doesn't start firing guns quickly. Okay, I'll restart my Xbox. Yeah, I, like I said, Brins, I don't... I, I don't know. Like I, like I would restart mine. Um, but then we've got to sit through the whole sitting through the menu screen again and Lee's already in and I need to get my challenges because I'm addicted to it like crack cocaine. The first step of admitting you have a problem is admitting it. And I have a problem, people. I need to get my objectives done. Wow, it's an all-female group. Don't I look a pimp? What's the... Right, like, like I already know that Lee is a dude. But what's the... You know, I bet all of... All these characters are guys. Ah, oh, shit. All, all, there's, there's three girls in that. And all of them are guys. You're oh, we got this one. Protégés, huh? He sent word you was decent. We go in quiet. I'll go quiet. I always go quiet on this scum. mission. I love my most of my time thinking they're better Ian's off. Angels, yeah. Ah, they're good ones. Real good ones. Hard beer cold. Yeah, but dude, oh, they, they could be all man, dudes. That just makes away. it weird. Like, like, we know Marshall. Lee's a dude. Good, like Tom Davies. US Marshall. Doesn't matter how many times my excuse is I'd rather look at a girl's behind while I'm playing. That's a really good reason, Lee. I like that reason. Like I never thought about it before like that. You know. I have a girl character because I like looking at girls' asses. Like, hell, I I'll, I'll agree with that. No arguments here. But yeah, just me and three girls just ran around. Like the only ever female character I had, <laughs> I'd rather look at my behind. Wait, uh, the only female character I ever made um, in a game was uh, that's that fucking eagle, <laughs> that fucking eagle Brinsley. Um, was in Dark Souls. I was playing Dark Souls once. Um, um, it's like my, it was like my second or third playthrough, and I decided that this one I would make a female elf character, and I would call her Linda because obviously I love my wife and she loves elves. No, and I, I so I did. I made her an elf to character. Too close to any of this. And then I just uh, played. Oh the wait, no, I, it's the second one. Sorry, because I've made one for the damn law is. Skyrim. I made a female well, character in Skyrim is, as well. Uh, well. Anyway, here's Lee. And she was the she was actually she was the original elf character Linda, and then the that character adapted into the Dark Souls ones, and both of them used bow and arrows. 
Johnson, and he both of them used uh, coming, glass. Tom. He's holed up and well, they're waiting for the one in Skyrim Cases used a glass sword guards, with a shield. Controls, everything. And it's going to um, be tough. You know? Dark Souls, mm. I was using the Uchi Katana well, for a long I... time, and then I changed to the Great Stone Sword. Because I just made control. enough strength that I could Three do it. If, you got them, or anything won't scare the birds out of the trees. I told if the Marshal told me I was coming in here with a bunch of greenhorns, I would have told him but where to stick it. Stay low, stay quiet. Right, I'm going to go quiet, but let's see who's the first one to pull a gun, shall we? What level have we got? What level character is 33, 9, oh, and I say just 11. Whoever, yeah, there we go. Gone loud already. Nailed him. Nailed him right off that fucking horse. Yeah, the more people we alert in this mission, the more people that actually turn up at the camp at the end. Go. Go, 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 go. Oh, why would you do that for? Jesus, why would you go loud? Like, like it's okay to go loud, but it's a waste of bullets. Save your fucking bullets. Bullets are expensive, especially when you're below level 50. Well, they were back in my day. Back in my day, bullets cost a fucking bomb. Nowadays, you get fucking sales like they're nobody's business. Yeah, I know. I'm confused. I didn't update my... I didn't get... Four, what the fuck? What the... What the fuck my challenge is? What the fuck? Just, I'm all over the place my challenges today. I've got one. That's fine. You don't need to worry, but still. It's because I'm drinking beer. Wow, I can hear the forest. It's like it's like gunfire. It's like Sarajevo out there. But I bet you it's pretty. Okay, nail him, boys. This guy's mine. Oh wow, I speared him right off his fucking feet. That was cool. I like that. Ian and his transgender posse can't say the shelfers aren't progressive. Hell yeah, man. You know, back in the day, dressing up the only person, you know, when you dressed up as a woman, it was like for comedy value. You know? And then as I grew up, dressing up as a woman became like a, like a thing. Like men really wanted to dress up in their women's clothes. You know? And then all of a sudden people started having a problem with it again. And I'm like, what the fuck? Have you never watched Eddie Izzard? Have you never watched Julian Clary or fucking Dame Edna? Fucking we've had men dressed as women in, for fucking years. There's an Irish comedian I was watching when I was younger. A female Irish comedian. Who was very butch. You know, and so I was, I was like, yeah, hell yeah, women can be fucking men too. Like, my mum raised me on her own, so she could be a dad and a fucking mum when she wanted to be. It was scary. Okay. Let's see if I can nail this guy before. He can nail No, no, you just blast them. You know, you guys aren't even fucking trying to be quiet. Like, I like to think that that's a bunch of girls playing, but at the same time, if it's guys, they're fucking shocking. <laughs> Like, he blatantly tells you in the cut sequence to try bow and arrows, you know, to be quiet and stealthy. But nope, we're just running out there like crazy bastards. Yeah, probably stealing a bunch of game to take back to a camp. Where would they be, Lee? This way? Oh, look, badger. Oh, missed it. Fucking missed a rabbit. You know what, if we're going loud, I'm fucking going loud. Fucking have this. You know, let's young gonna go loud. Might as well go proper loud. Let's get the buck too. 
brought a knife to a gunfight. <laughs> yeah, I did as well, but, you know, it... nobody's caring. We're just killing everything in our path. Alright, I need to, I want to loot this body. So, anybody got any big plans for the weekend? I am hanging out with my good buddy Tom tomorrow night. We're probably going to play some Gears and have some beers. Um, obviously, I'll be... Um, I want to be on in the morning tomorrow for um, for the challenges. But I do have to pop into work early to sort out my work routine next week. So I won't be on, possibly, until roughly about 10 uh, to about dinner time. Uh, UK. Obviously, I will be on anyway, because, well, you know I can't go a day without doing my freaking job, but you know I can. Um, but hopefully I can be on at the same time so I can grab uh, Brinsley, because I need Brinsley just in case there's any fucking, um, any posse challenges. And Lee as well, if Lee's on. Oh, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, nice. We've got, um, game, oh, I knew too, I, I was thinking too many people had died. Uh, so i got to wait for all the other people to restart checkpoint. Saturday night, I'm hanging out with Gary and the boys for some board gaming. Uh, we might be playing some Twilight Imperium or some Battlestar Galactica with maybe just a hint of Mysterium thrown in there as well. No need to be quiet no more. A lot of you are probably thinking, like, what the hell? Like, board games? Like, yeah, that's what we do at the weekends. Instead of sitting in the pub just blowing our money away. Shot some fools. This guy. Well, oh, he's dead. Ah, crazy bastards! Can't see nothing. It's too dark. It's too dark. I can't see nothing. <laughs> okay, that was that was really bad. Like I couldn't see anything. I ran through there thinking, shit, I'm gonna grab somebody, but no. I, I'll just lie here. Brinsley will save me. Somebody will save me. Somebody always saves the Simpsons kids. Bit of Treehouse of Horror there for you. There you go. BNB. Nice. Thank you very much, man. You saved me. Mm. Like, I didn't kill anybody then. <laughs> I would save you if I was there. Yeah, oh yeah, so Brins, I, I totally oh, forgot you're not in the server. The Come here. <laughs> my bad, my bad, Brins. Fist bump, bro. Fist bump. Fist bumps all around to everybody. <sighs> boom, 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 hey. Right down the list. Sorry, I'm on my second beer. Getting a bit lightheaded now. <laughs> like, I, I never have been a hardcore drinker. Like, I always pretended to be, I'll admit it now, I always pretended to be when I was hanging out with friends to, to hit back the shots and drink the beers and try and stay up as late as I could. But if I'm completely honest with myself and everybody else out there, you know, after two or three beers, I fucking get tired and I just want to sit down with a film and chill out. Like, when I was younger, like I said, I used to hit it really hard with, the fr with my friends because they didn't want to sit and chill. You know, I had friends who really wanted to get messed up. They really wanted to get drunk, uh, cause trouble, and, you know, have stories to tell the next day. You know, you always wanted a story to tell, to turn to people and say, Oh, God, do you remember last night? You know, remember when Bill fucking fell in the bush? Oh, God, that's brilliant. When you have friends like that, after, like, ten... For like 10 fucking shots of vodka, my legs are just gone. You know, my legs, like, all I want to do is I just want to sleep. And it was always the same when I was younger. You know, I remember one birthday, I stayed up for 24 hours. I was non-stop drinking. Thought it was a really fucking good idea. 
Um, thought it was a really good idea. Yeah, it's my birthday weekend, so Friday night we started drinking. We stayed up all night. Uh, a few of friends. We hit some Pro Plus. You know the caffeine fucking tablets. So we hit some Pro Plus, Stay with me. and that kept us awake all through the day. And I carried on drinking. You know, I was literally having beer with a cup of tea at like fucking half past ten in the morning. I was still drinking till Saturday night. That Saturday night. And at one point I passed out. I don't remember really what fucking happened after that. Like I was out. And I didn't actually really get coherency again until um, Sunday evening. That weekend. Like I woke up Sunday hey, evening, it was like seven o'clock at night. I was hot. I felt horrible, tired. I had work the next day. You know, I did. I all I wanted to do was I wanted somebody to take me outside and kill me because my brain was sloshing around in beer. And, and did you ever drink 2020? I mean, probably this is only really for the English um, commenters in the comment section, but 2020. It was like a, a mixture of alcohol and fruit juice. Oh my god, that stuff's horrible. And I drank a bottle of that and it was the okay. worst, the worst. Uh, Brinsley, I actually don't drink anymore. I quit smoking so don't want to get drunk and relapse. Mate, hell yeah, man. Um, I drink take it in moderation now. Like San Miguel is the only beer that I drink. Well, this should show folks that we're willing to bring Like, I can drink San Miguel like can. nobody's business. But, this ain't Montana. but hmm? anything ain't else will Montana. really get me messed up. And just like you, oh, um, smoking. I was a big smoker for a long time. You lot, and drink, drinking and smoking go promise, hand in hand. Given that you killed so I might. Like, yeah, Mad Dog me. 2020. Now, let's be clear. Yes. Jorge Montez was a no good um, son of a bitch. Yeah, drinking. Like, head. I always Only feel like I need to have a cigarette when I have sink. a beer. Because I just love right, the taste. Friends, it's horrible. You. It's freaking maybe fucking horrible. But I love it. I love the taste of a cigarette with, uh, with a beer. Maybe, uh, Kicking back and just. There. <laughs> You know, that's when you know you exist, I suppose. Yeah, really, I existence really well, kicks in. Happen, you're Lee. killing yourself with a cancerous, uh, disgusting like object. And think it's the greatest oh. fucking thing in the world to chill to. That's existence. You know, when you get to heaven and somebody goes, Welcome to heaven, do you want all knowledge? You're like, no, I just need a packet of fags. Like, I need a fag. Like, I'm not going to die, so it doesn't care. I just need another fag. Cigars, I can't do cigars. Cigars make me really sick. Right, okay, we're finished there. So I'm going to try and get Lee into, not Lee, Brinsley into the um, into the posse. I'm going for a cigarette, don't judge. Oh, no, I'm, I'm not judging you, Lee. Save me twos. <laughs> Save me twos. Make sure to go outside, Lee, as well. Every smoker should go outside. Even fucking e-cigarette smokers. You used to be a smoker. You know the rules. Go outside. Oh, man. This beer is way too light. Story mission completed. Boom. Okay. Posse members. Bluntmaster. Invite to session. Oh, Bluntmaster. I got you an invite. Bloodmaster, I just sent you an invite, so hopefully that has set you up. If that's the case, if you and Lee are in, then I can go and I can pop outside for a cigarette while you two watch my back. Yeah, okay, what are we on? I still need to get my belt buckle and I still need to get my drink at the saloon. Showdowns. So that's it, all we've got to do is showdowns after. Is it called 2020 because after a bottle your vision certainly isn't anymore <laughs> <laughs> Man, I don't know why they called it 2020. It was it was horrible. Bloodmaster, my boy! Woohoo! Yay! Yeah! Pa pa pa! I love getting my posse together. Love it. The servers may not work properly every now and again, but we get it together. Okay. I'm going to head to Blackwater. I'm going to do my belt. I'm going to get my drink. And then I'm going to pop outside. And then we are going into showdowns, boys. So make sure your guns are clean and your shit is prepared. Because we got to do three showdowns. And we got to get kills from cover. Yay. 
Yeah, boy. Brinsley, for those of you who don't know, you probably, uh, if you're not part of the Discord, Brinsley and Lee have been playing um, a lot of games with each other recently. So they're a bit like Butch Cassidy and the Sundance game. And I've just heard... There. Show another pheasant. Where do I see the other pheasant going? There he's up there. There he goes. Sorry, I heard the pheasants as I saw the wolves. And I had to deal with the wolves first, but I need the fat. Um, I need the fat so I can put it in the guns, so I can... So I can get those cover... kill covers. go the chicks with dicks posse i like to think that there's a lot of female players out there on here you know maybe there are female players out there who are who are playing as as a uh, dude you know we never hear we never hear about that and because we don't hear about that we immediately assume that it doesn't happen well i don't humans do humans can be very judgmental I'm not judgmental. I just choose not to like something if I don't want to. Like signs. All right. Oh, oh Jesus, Arctex! What the fuck happened there? Like I honestly thought we we were just jumping over something, but you literally had left the floor and I had left your back. All right. Okay. Come on, Arctex. I'll go get to the, go get the black water. Can't get distracted now. Brinsley's not dressed as a woman. Maybe we should all just dress as. Just, I I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing that Rockstar did. That they only they made particular clothes like one sex orientated. Uh, Campbell, Campbell's awake. Thought I would wake up early to play Red Dead and go hunting. Finally found Brandy Drop Drop Treasure. Hey, okay, well um, maybe I can send you an invite. We got some boys on, and I still got some. Boom. Obviously, for those who don't know, Campbell lives over in New Zealand, so he is 13 hours ahead of us, actually. Um, so sometimes when I'm on at night time, it's easier for him to be on because he's just waking up in the day. It's really crazy when it comes to time zones. Right, okay, change my belt, get my drink, get my two challenges, and I'm all good. We'll hang out in Blackwater for a little bit while we get ourselves ready before we head into the showdown. And then, if we can get Campbell in as well, we'll have a four man posse heading in. Oh, we could do the bank robbery mission. <gasps> bank robbery excitement. Remember me from Hyde Park, Harvey, the annoying one. Thanks. Thanks, Harvey. Yes. There we go. Got my beer. How's this look? There we go. Get my beer. Got one challenge done. Now I can head over to the general store and get my boat done. Oh, tell me there's a clothing department in Blackwater. There it is. I was going to say, the wardrobe did not appear in the general store. So I need to head to the clothes, which is through here, through here, can I bash through the door? Nope, the door's locked. Ah, have to take a long way around, through the alleyways. Oh. Hey, friend, how you doing? Go around this way, go around, it's Black War. I spent a lot of time in Black War when I, back in the day. I used to do a lot of hunting down here. I'm being Ronan. I'm in Australia. It's 7 a.m. here. Oh, wow. Um, I need to change my belt buckle. Here we go. Jeeve79. Now I want... Just watch the signs review. I reckon you're not a fan, huh? Well, I said earlier, I am a fan. I just... I just don't think it's one of his better films. 
Now I want Gary to shit all over District 9 and watch your reactions. Dude, you ain't ever, you ain't ever, 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 ever watching Gary shit on District 9. Ever. Like, the day Gary shits on District 9 is the day I stop fucking reviewing films. Because I'll be like, I don't know who you are anymore, friend. You're like, not because I love, um... Not that I, not that I um, love District Nine that much, but Gary was the one who got me into it. You know, he absolutely loved that movie so much. He was like, "Dude, you need to watch this," and I was just like, "Oh, okay, yeah, it sounds cool." And then, and then I watched it, and I was like, "This, it's one of the greatest sci-fi movies ever made." Fucking prawns! You fucking prawns! You come around here to fucking country? You fucking, you do fucking prawns? Fucking great! I mean, uh, oh, what's his name? Not Yafet Koto, that's fucking alien. Yanton? Yeah, no, Yanton. Um, no, that's fucking. Um, People say from Star Trek. All sound the same. What's the guy? What's the, what's the guy? What's the guy who I was doing the impression of? The uh, uh, Shelton Coplo. Is it Shelton Coplo? He is fucking excellent in that movie. Fucking excellent. Like I really felt for him all the way through. You know, we we said a lot about. Um, we said a lot about Chappie. Chappie, he, his voice in Chappie was brilliant. Right, okay. I've done my belt. I've done my drinks. And we've got three showdown series and three players to kill from cover. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to park myself here at the wardrobe. And while you guys are behaving yourselves in Blackwater, I'm just going to nip off. I'll be back in five minutes, and then we'll be heading into showdown. So I'm going to put it on some clothes, because you don't want to just look at the fucking... You don't want to just look at that goddamn page. I'm going to put it on like there, and I'll be back in five minutes. Take it easy, guys. You can't beat an expertly put-together outfit. Masks usually up to no good. I only stock the best in my shop. Buy from me, and you'll never be disappointed. Let me know what I can do to help you leave here feeling good and looking great. If you have any questions, you just let me know. I stand behind everything I sell in this place so you can purchase with confidence. Get out of the way, damn you. You best go find a teeth to suck on. Please, peruse at your leisure. I carry only the finest items.
I only stock the best in my shop. Buy from me, and you'll never be disappointed. Okay, you sexy bitches, I am back. Let's get this shit done. Boys, you all ready? Guns all cleaned? Can you turn your sound up, book? Is it low? I didn't realize it was low. Um, is that better? Is that better? Is it better? Yeah, it should be better. I think it should be better. Oh, did you write that because I because I wasn't talking? I get all sorts walking into this establishment. Oh man, well, I cannot wait for us to come back from showdown so we can have a good old team in fighting because there's four of us. You know how I love my team in fighting. Yeah, we look all pimp as fuck, boys. Right, I gotta clean my guns. Right, that one's done. Pistol needs cleaning. You always got to do this. You always got to do this uh, before you go into a showdown because you go in the, when you go into a showdown, it doesn't just automatically clean them. It actually, you know, you carry on with how bad they are. Um, and so you literally you got to um, you got to you got to clean them all because if you go into a certain game and you're like, oh, I want that gun. Instead of that, and you haven't cleaned it, you're, you're screwed. Uh, right, Campbell, we are ready for showdowns. You all ready? I'm going to give you a couple seconds so you can write it in the chat to say if you're ready for um, showdown or not. Oh, your posse is too large to join this series. Oh, yeah, because you need the host in there as well. Right, showdown. Uh, yep, yeah, Lee's all ready. Brinsley, you all ready? I'll probably go on to large. I'll just wait for Campbell to write if he's ready or not. I walk around like a goddamn pimp. Brinsley's all ready. I'm all ready. I'm waiting still wait for Campbell. Campbell's the other one who's not ready. Red, readied up yet. I'm going to hit it in two seconds. I'm waiting for it to pop up in the chat. It takes like 13 hours for it to come from uh, New Zealand. Obviously, the uh, Kiwis over there have um, different ways of typing. Ready. Okay. Boom. We're in the I just want to say now, I want to thank everybody for buying the game and joining me in Posse, uh, in the Bandido Posse when we play. Because to tell you the truth, when I honestly started this, when I said to the guys, like when I said to Gary and Linda, I said, Look, I want to stream, I want to do my challenges daily. I honestly thought I was going to be doing it on my own because I'd been doing it for my on my own for so long. You know, I'd got the game, I'd played it with the guys, the guys had said, this is shit, Nobody, nobody's going to be playing this, and they left. And I just kind of carried on playing it on my own. And then, as I made the game more of on my own, I was having so much fun, I wanted to share it with people. I wanted to share how much fun I was having. <gasps> Name your weapon free for all. Oh god, this is going to be... This is going to be... This is going to be tough. All four of us are going to be against each other, and you're going to have to choose your weapon. Are we going to go tomahawks? Are we going to go um, shotguns? Yeah, Brinsley, I saw you. Um, oh, cheers, Campbell. Cheers for that. Uh, Brinsley, I saw you were obviously streaming as well. Um, so it was so cool to watch it from a, to watch my stream from a different angle, you know, to actually, and it was just it just was so entertaining. You know, just us running around the world, just messing around. I, I first initially started doing it with Zane. Big up to our boy Zane over in Texas. And, you know, I'd played with people before. We'd done GTA 5. It was just, and it was just trying to find fun things to do. Like at first, a name your weapon free for all deathmatch and tall trees I'd have hated. Because I know how people like to see... People like to watch people win. You know, people like to watch people do really well. It's all about your kill-death ratio 
and kicking ass and all that shit. Um, and I'd play this mode and get my ass handed to me and I didn't want to do it. Now I don't care. If I go in here and lose, I don't care because I want to see how well Brinsley does. I want to see how well Campbell does. I want to see how Lee does. It's not just about me. It's about the show for banditos. Yeah. <laughs> DMC, I don't want to die. DMC is going to be dynamiting all over the place, so watch out for that. Brinsley is going to be sneaking with his fucking um, with his tomahawk. Me, I go for the double barrel shotgun. Double barrel shotgun, three points, and if you can get enough kills with it, you can skyrocket. But uh, if you can find the the people who score really quickly, be careful. If you watch somebody score really quickly, they've got explosive rounds. And so you kind of want them to waste those explosive rounds or you're just going to get fucking shot every two seconds. Also, if you get to the top spot, um, nobody else shows up on your radar. So you may have 45 points, but you are now the biggest target on the map. Yeah, I'm thinking Tomahawk all the way as well. I mean, I, lo I don't I don't care handing out all my tips. Uh, Tomahawks, there's so many on the map that you can run from each one and just keep killing. But you just got to hit people with it and not die. So that's what I might do. <laughs> I do look a bit pimp with that hat. No, right, okay. Let's get that out. Uh, or always pop that. And listen to the music as well. Alright, there's a gun down there. There's somebody behind me already. I can hear gunfire. If we can find a shotgun, that would be great. There! Ah! Oh, double barrel shotgun, take me out. That'll do it. Twelve points. That's either two kills of a tomahawk or four kills of a double barrel shotgun. Where? Where is he? Oh, come on! Man, that angry fire nailed me. Uh, okay. What level is the angry fire? Uh, 324. The Angry Fighter is level 324. That's what I say for that. There. Gotcha. And I just shot him in the back. I shot the 324 in the back. Hells yes. Um, I don't care if I lose or not now. I just killed that guy. Okay, keep running. There, there, left. There he is. Uh, gotcha. Stamina. Because you're running a lot. Tall trees is horrible. I love this place hunting, but I hate this place in deathmatch. Because you can't stop people mold into the trees. They, you know, they just literally come out of nowhere, and you're like, "Fuck! I didn't even know he was there." R radar is basically useless. Nobody turns up on radar unless they're really close, or they've got a lot of points. Nobody's turned up yet. There's gunfire over there. 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 Oh shit, reload. Oh crap. Who's that? Go. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Oh. Spotted that guy to my left. Spotted him and it was just too late. It was too late, friend. I should be getting into cover. Why aren't we not in cover, boys? Screw the, screw the challenge. Who's that? Whoever that is, he took a double barrel shotgun to the back. No. Oh. Come here. Ah. Oh. Goddamn bitch. Love it. Love this game. Counting down the days though to uh, Doom 2019. I don't know if anybody's seen the battle mode for that. Very excited for that. 
three-way deathmatch. Oh, fuck that. Double barrel shotgun. Everyone's told you double barrel shotgun. I could be jumping into cover, um, but name your name your weapons. I always find it really difficult to pull off certain challenges. He's on the other side this time. Shit. Ah! Oh, fuck! Fucking! I should have grabbed him. I, I, I went for the grab, but I changed my mind halfway through and decided to throw the tomahawk instead. In here, somebody's near. Grab that. Get the other tomahawk. There. Ah, oh, double barrel from that angle and that height, and you still killed me in one hit. Yeah, that. Grab that. He's over here. Come on. Oh, where is he? He's there. Gotcha. Nailed you with that, and I'm gonna steal this one as well. Ah, shit. Shit. There's a guy there. Oh, three guys. Got him! Oh, it's Campbell! That's a bad Campbell! <laughs> Man, there was three. I didn't even see where I did. Dots just appeared all around me. I was like, okay, if I get out of this, it's, it's gonna be good. I didn't. I didn't. Oh, shit! Shit! Where is he? Oh, fuck! No! Ah, shit! Oh! Blunt master. It's a bad, bad blunt master. I don't care. I don't care, Gringo. I gotta get out there and get the points. What's the point score, actually? Well, nobody's in the top ten. None of us are in the top ten. Oh, top. Ah, uh... oh, you. I brought a tomahawk to a gunfight. Yeah, I forgot I needed the cover as well. Yeah. I'm not even going for the cover one, because we still need to get... We need to play three games. So, I can, we can get it in the next couple. I'm just here for fucking Tomahawk shit. I've gone, I've gone full Tomahawk. Come on. There. There. Oh, he's behind the tree. Stay by the tree. Stay by the tree. Ah, oh, he's gone. Rock, what the Come on. Oh. Ah, shit. Gotcha. No, come on. Got it. Oh, did I get him? Tell me I got him. No. Thought I got him. What are we looking at, boys? Uh, 789. Can I get one more before we come off? Tom Hall. Oh! Ah! Yeah. say that was a failure but I don't care I, you know, I get, like you say painfully I, I think we were just we just need to play three so a loss is a loss anyway who came top I was waiting for it to come up saying that's that's that and, and that's 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 just a you know, brutal tribune what's the um Oh, wow, 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 boys, wow, well, well, eighth, yeah, eighth, it's not bad, you're eating the last of my cookies, are you, wife, my wife is eating the last of my cookies, mm-hmm,
<laughs> De Niro in a fucking War Burton's advert. Man, you can't. It's on there. It's De Niro in a War Burton's advert and Harvey Keitel selling us insurance. It's where we come in the world. If I could get Joe Pesci to sell me, what would Joe Pesci sell me? Ooh. Okay, we are all in the old campaigners, yes. Windows. Windows? Change my guns. I need to change my guns. Uh, Springfield. Lancaster. Yes. Right, where are we? Blackwater. Hostile territory. Okay, gentlemen. Oh, RV. Ravon Williams is a great film. Uh, yeah, home insurance. Okay, we are going to spawn. Now, we're either going to spawn at the train station, uh, no, City Hall at Blackwater, or we're going to start on the outskirts. Either way, we need to control D. If we can, if we're on the outskirts, we need to get D and E, or D and C. C is the barn, which is just over from D, and everybody heads there. There's a lot of shit that goes on there. D, you can get on top of the roof, or you can hide inside the bar, and then you just got to fucking hold it. Okay, the train station's really, City Hall and the train station are really easy to hold. If we get those two, we can sit on those two and then we can, we'll just slap and defend it. The only place that's difficult is if we have to start at the barn first, because you have to go through the barn to get to D. And the barn, like I said, is that, is spot C, I think it is, which is a bastard to hold when everybody's going for it. So I say... I say I'm heading to D. I'm going to take D. And then we'll just see where we go from there. If you want to cover me, cool. If you want to if you want to head somewhere else, that's fine. But I'm heading to D. Joe Pesci was in a Google advert. Selling you Google. Obviously, at the same time, if we all split up and just do crazy shit trying to mess with everyone else's points, we won't win. But we're just getting challenges, aren't we? Cover challenges. And another win for the showdowns. Let's do this, banditos. You're up. Swing, buddy, 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 buddy. Swing, buddy, swing. This is when I get my head blown off. D. Through the side door into the bar. Upstairs. D is done. Here come purples and blues. We have got incoming. Obviously, oh, yeah, yeah. Do not stand around because they will dynamite you. Places are difficult to find. We've got C and D. Nice work, boys. Told you. Like I said, C is a difficult one to hold. If we can grab E from the purples, we'll kind of be laughing. Oh, nice. Watch out for the orange. He's coming through the door. Got him. Second one's outside. Lee, get the cover. Come through the door. Oh, gee, okay. Told you I was going to hold D. If you need one cover kill, come to the bar. Oh, I just killed a lot of people at the front of the bar. Oh god. No, the stick of dynamite. Oh, uh, here it goes. I, I don't know if it killed anybody. Maybe it did, maybe it didn't. Come on, game, I need to get back in it. Yes, I killed somebody else. Death from beyond. Okay, heading back to D. Oh, we got E? Oh, we had E. No, we're yellow, sorry. Ugh. Oh, I 
killed him as he got to the top. Going for the roof. Oh shit. No, I'm not. <laughs> I was going for the roof and then a bullet entered through my nose and told me otherwise. Explosive rounds are always great for showdowns. And I have not got none. Go, up to eat. Was it Lee who got stuck in the cover? He got actually got stuck in the building once. Fully glitched the game. Uh coming upstairs. Shit, there's two. Shit, there's three. Oh, fuck, motherfucker. <sighs> yeah, it was Lee. I knew it was. Okay, we're still holding C? Okay. Are we heading to C? I might head to C and then you C to head to D. I wish I brought my shotgun now. Here, gunfire. Oh. oh shit. Oh. Get over the fence, you ding back. Oh Christ. There's a lot of shit going on and I don't know why. See, everybody wants to see. Okay, then if that's the case, I will take. Everybody's upstairs. He's in the house. Oh shit. Oh, mother. Fucking. Part of my French. The purples have taken everything. They've taken it all from us, and yet oranges are still winning. Inside the barn, that's why it's such a bastard to try and take. People hide inside the, they hide inside the barn. Then you just sit in there and wait for you to run in. And you can run and you can take other locations while everyone's trying to cover that cover that one. Hey, somebody's taken E. I'm gonna head back to D, because I like the D. Leave C, boys. C is a death trap. Like I said, if we can take D, at least we can get some points. Alright, purples aren't getting any more from D. Ah, shit. Get shot. Inside. No. Okay. Get it. Pop it. Took the D. Need cover. Again behind the bar. Ah, purple coming through. The... No, go. Jump over cover. Nice. Ah, oh, you motherfucker! You just. If I've got my regular rounds out, I want my fucking pistol on Pissed. One shot on there. One shot on there. No shots. God damn it. Ah, last 10 seconds. Last 10 seconds. C. I hate C. Such a C. 
kill point. C is such a kill point. You, nobody ever thinks to spread to A or B. The other team spawn behind me before I can even get anywhere. Yeah, that's the, also the problem as well. Because you spawn in the outskirts. As soon as you die, you're back in. And if you're at anywhere like C or D, you're just getting blasted. Um, and sometimes that's what people also do as well, is that they stop. They stop fighting because there's no point in winning. They might as well just get the kills because, well, you get the experience. And it levels you up faster, which means you can buy stuff, which means you can get the explosive rounds. But, I mean, we got, what, second one? Was that the first or the second one for the Showdown series? And I got two for a cover. Oh, we're in tall trees again for Name Your Weapon. Ugh. God damn it, game. I like poultry. It's it is a beautiful place. You got your cover one. Nice. I've got one more to get of my cover, and either one or two of the Shonen series plate. Vote to kick. Let's check the players out. 18, 41, 229. Oh, wait. Problem no. 229. Mac, Marcus Maximus is 187. 218, Fervent Joker. Ooh. See, people always end up trying to kick people who don't have ranks. Um, but I've actually found that people who don't have actually ranks aren't actually broken. They just um, they just haven't loaded in properly yet. Like Campbell was one. People tried to kick Campbell from a, from a server and I was like, he's like... He's like level 11. Yes, I would certainly suggest to everybody to uh, level up. Um, just to get to the higher levels. Guns, you know, honestly, the guns don't really do anything. They honestly really don't. The bullets do. They have, the guns may have a little bit of different range and slight damage or reload. But the bullets are what you what you need. You know, if you can, if you can, like my Lancaster with the express rounds, I've always said it's just disgusting. You're just clicking in through them, and when it's cleaned all the way properly, you can unload that and kill like three or four people in a couple of shots as long as you get your headshots done. And they're not doing the same thing. The explosive rounds do make a hell of a difference. You will certainly notice it when you get into a game and you're just killing. You're maxed out on explosive rounds. Right. Oh, okay. Shotgun. Let's get the shotgun right from the start. Let's pop that. Cop that. And let's go. There he is. Right there. Go, 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 go. Shot me clean in the face of a cattleman revolver. God damn. I should be trying to go for cover, actually. While I'm here, let's check it. Um, we've got one more person to kill from cover and two showdown series to play. Come on. So, not aiming for points. We are aiming for cover kill. I can't really get a cover kill really here. I need to be in cover. <coughs> Could use the trees, I suppose. Gunfire. Fuck it. Second round, second shot. Oh, you motherfucker! Uh, can we do the bank mission after showdown? Yes, we can. 
I will definitely set that one up. Um, yeah, once obviously we've got the showdown challenges done, uh, the last thing we'll do before the infighting, because we've got to have an infight before we come up, we'll do the uh, back bumper, which will be cool as a four way. I will need to bring my honor level down because my honor level is at the max at the moment. Guy. Um, mother. Mother. Did you forget your name? Did you leave it on the floor playing tic tac toe? <sighs> Take a breath. It's just tall trees. I hate tall trees. I think people could be anywhere. This place is a fucking maze when it, you know, when it wants to be. It's like living in Blair Witch. Here's a guy. Here's a guy. Two guys. What the fuck? <coughs> what the? Like, I hit that guy. I I hit that guy fresh on. Wow, oh, where is he? Ah, where's he? Got me. Shit! <coughs> Shit, what the fuck? by somebody else. <laughs> so he came along, found us, tomahawked me, and then shot the other guy. Bastard. Right. Here, but I cannot see. People are dying all around me, and I don't know where. Let's go. Oh shit! Got him. Nailed that guy right through the, through the trees. Got the tunnel. Go 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 go. Grouped up in the middle somewhere. Ah, uh, gunfire. Shotgun. Or stick with the tomahawk. Uh. Come on. Go. <gasps> Two. Oh, that's just one guy. Huh? Pulled my gun and cocked it. He'd already killed me before I'd even. Ah, man. Talk about quick draw. 1866. Man. Like.
like sometimes people get you before you can even before you can even pull your gun to, to cock it. Was that really her again? Wow, brutal tribute. Hmm, has she got a lag switch? <laughs> Brinsley got zero kills? <gasps> well, at least you got the actual playing it. I've still got to get a cover kill. And I've still got to get one more showdown. Tried to use dead eye on you, but ran out. <laughs> yeah, you got to keep, you got to monitor it, you know. Like, your health, when you spawn again, your health is at half. You know, when you start the level, your, your dead eye's at nothing. So you have to pop a tonic as soon as you can run out. So you get the bar, so you're not running off the core. And then your health as well. If you can pop, uh, like, a health one, you'll have it fortified. So if somebody does shoot you, you won't instantly die. And you'll be able to turn around and get them back. Oh, name your weapon teams now. Okay, boys. This is it. We are, we are. We're on the spotlight now, boys. <clears throat> I mean, I'm not saying we have to win. I, it's not about the winning, it's about the taking part from where I stand. Um, but I will be looking to get more points than the rest of you. Yeah, you know, it's simple, simple etiquette, simple, you know, deathmatch etiquette. Like I'm sure you guys are going to try and get more points than me, which is absolutely fine. All's fair in in in, you know, fucking uh, deathmatch and war. What time are we on? We are on twenty to eleven at night. Wow. Friday tomorrow. And I've got to go into work early. Ooh. Just for them to tell me what work I have to do next week. Which is fine. You know, as long as I have a plan. I say, yeah, this is what I'm doing. But I'm on the... No, I'm not on the dandies, but I'm on the dandy. Did they split us up? Because there's not many of us. Where am I? Whoa, whoa. Okay. DMC is usually easy to find, but he's not using dynamite at the moment. He's getting better. His shots are getting better. It's me I worry about. It's way past my bedtime. They they they, they split us up at the last second. That's what I thought. Because the teams weren't even. Makes it more challenging though for the posse. That's what I find. You gotta work for your position. You're like, hey man, last time we played, we got more kills. You know? That's why I don't think the rank actually means anything other than unlocking stuff. Do do, do do do, do do do. I'm going for the shotgun. I know where the shotgun is. Cover as well, no. Uh, uh, okay, that's green. Oh, like, wow. She does just pop out of cover and just kill you in seconds. That is, she is a disgusting shot with that shotgun. Um, need to eat. Oh no 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 no! Ow! Popping health at the same time as getting shot in the face is not fun. But it's the life we live in this red net world. Who's on my team? Oh, that was just nice to see. Get the shotgun out. Where's the pink? There's the pink. 
like it, oh, his mate's behind me. Did not see his mate until the very, very last second. And by that time, I was always shot in the back. Well, I got three points. Oh, it's me and Lee. Gotcha. Okay, right. There's another one down there. There. Got him. Okay, okay. Need a cover. Need to get a good kill. I'm heading for the shotgun. If you can keep up with me, that's cool. If not, don't worry about it. Uh, yeah, those. There. Oh, fuck it. So he knew I was there as soon as he, as soon as he hit that cover. He hit me ferociously tapping my ex joker. Don't care. It just means I'm hardcore gaming. Where's the shotgun? Where's the shotgun? This way, head this way, Lee. Over the boxes. Then why am I jumping over the boxes? You got my back? Yep. Right, okay, there's a green, there's two greens. Yeah. Oh, fuck. oh, you fucker. Got him, nice. Watch out behind us, there's a green and an orange. Pop some health. Oh, shit. Pop that. Get that as well. The other one. Where's the other one? Oh shit. Campbell. Gotcha, Campbell. And where's the red? Gotcha. Got Blunt Master as well. Look at that. that was, oh, right. Go to the train. To the train. Get to the train, um, Lee, so we can get the bone arrow. Add it. Get to the end. Get to the end. There's a blue. Oh shit, get out. Get that pink, two pinks. Get that. Get that. Shotgun. Oh, he's got. Is he? Oh fuck. <sighs> Didn't have my shotgun out. I just noticed that at the last second I popped the tonic. And it had the. It hadn't re-equipped my shotgun. So when I hit fire, nothing happened. Makes you want to swear and say naughty words. But I'm not going to, because it's naughty. Here's the red. I didn't mean to shoot him. I did. I, I'm lying if I, if I didn't mean to. But at least I know you guys are red now, so I'm kind of going to be aiming for red if I see you red. There's a red! There's another, there's another red, but I think red dead. Red dead. Up behind me. Get back. Oh. Bastard. I still only got one out of three. So, yeah, I did as well. I don't think it actually counted the first one. Well, actually, no, I'm on two, I think. No, I'm on one as well. Right, so it will count this one, hopefully. the next one, hopefully. Oh, yellow, oh shit. Come on, yellow, come on, yellow, what are you doing? What are you doing? Come on, come on, what are you doing? You want this? Go check. You didn't like that, did you? No, you did not. Where are we? Where are we? Through the alley. I can see Lee over there. Lee, I can see you on the other side, but I'm splitting up from here at the moment. I'll be faster on my own. Oh, where did he go? Oh shit, there's a red behind me. Who's that? 
Oh, that brutal Truitt guy. He is, he is disgusting. Like, he's on your team. Is he on your team, Bloodmaster? Yeah. Will Reload dodged two of them from the wrong hole. God damn it, that guy is running. Ping behind me. <sighs> like, I think Brinsley's actually got this one. Oh, Davey's off the bed. Night, Davey. Yeah, I should be off the bed soon as well, but I need to. I've got to get my challenges done. Check the challenges as we get to the next one. Your teammate, Brinsley, was disgusted. Like, he killed me every time he saw me. And seriously, I saw him a lot. Hey, that's the third, second or third time he's been MVP. And we know because he's fucking level 300, but Jesus wept. Like, he, he killed me before I even knew he was there. Like, it was like, oh, there's a target? Dead. No, it's all fine, Lee. It's all fine. We we worked hard. Like like, I mean, I got some kills. I don't know how you like. I was leaving you off to do your own because, you know, when you when you're low level, you gotta know the maps just like any death match. But I'm just having my challenges. I need a cover kill. I need a cover kill. That make me feel better. And what is it? Ten to eleven. One more showdown. Bank robbery and then infighting. All in that order. Hostile territory. Here we go. Max out on tonics again. Get rid of the bow. Yes, get rid of the bow. Um, what else have we got? We've got Lancaster. Take the pump action. Whoa. Right, has anybody else seen this? Because that's it, my game is yeah, my game is just loading me in. It's just you know, it's like, here you go, you're in. I'm like, okay. Right, before you start, check your challenges. That's what I'm going to do. I'm trying to fight the arrows to use dynamite. It's not easy. Campbell, use dynamite. I don't know if you saw when in the Blackwater version, I used like three sticks of dynamite in the, in the bar. Killed like two people. People don't expect it because you're running up and they're trying to shoot with a, with a rifle because, you know, they think they're good with a rifle and you're just lobbing dynamite at them. Like, fuck you! Right, I go for A. Checking challenges as I'm here. Oh, one of three? Again? It did not count that last showdown. What the... What the fuck? Dynamite arrows, I'd be going for B. But keep an eye on A because A will get taken. Okay, need to get into cover, Ian. Need to get into cover. Get into B. Going to B, head upstairs. Shotgun. Take a B. Oh, 
I can see as well. Nice job, boys. Nice job. I'm still at B at the moment. Nobody's heading up here. going on tonight <laughs> man it's just online gaming online gaming can be crazy that's why it's always good to record it well we have lost uh right we've lost a i'm heading, over, heading back to a we've still got b are we recapturing a are we nice oranges are all over the shop Indoors? I think he's indoors. No? Yeah? Oh. Dead. <gasps> so fucking dead. Uh, yeah, head back away. A seems to be the kill point at the moment. B is being nicely held for no other reason than they just haven't got to it yet. shot just popped me right between the eyes. Yeah, trying to take B. It's contested. B's contested. Good work, Banditos. It's just getting into the groove after a while. Once you get into the groove, you start. We all start kicking ass. Oh. Where is he? There. Oh. Right there, I just spotted him at the last second. Oh, somebody's popping explosive rounds. Nice. We got A. Lost B. Trying to intently concentrate as well as obviously be providing good, good wholesome entertainment to the masses while carrying a bow and arrow with explosive arrows. And try to get my other challenges as well. I need to kill one more person from cover. Nice, we are all over that. They're gonna start spawning again though. So she just killed them all. Ready to move from A to B, maybe C as well. Cover. Like, that was an onslaught, guys. Like, I'm wondering if we've got that other guy on our team now. Oh, wow, the oranges have just kicked ass down there. Can I get in cover? Going 
Gotcha. Get in, cover. Cover kill. Fire kill. Whoa, shit. Regular. It changed in my regular fucking rounds. I did. Oh, okay. Fire arrows. We're all, all over C, are we? Into C. Alright, I've got A. A is good. <coughs> oh, B is good. We can take C. 12, 13, 14. Kills. Yes, I have. Right. Last one. Hopefully, this is our last. Hopefully, this is our last um, showdown challenge we have to get. Um, as long as it's logged, this should be the last showdown we've got to get. And if it is, once we've done the showdown, then we're on to the bank robbery, and then the, and then I'll be coming off. Cause it's late. I'm tired and I need my beauty sleep. We've done more than three. We should have done it by now. We we should. Sometimes the game just doesn't count them. It's weird. Like, we should be on two now. And after this one. Yeah. Like I said, Lee, after this one... Um, I, Actually, I'll chuck it to a vote. We've got... Well, actually, no, the game starts in 10 seconds. No, we'll leave it. Yeah, we'll do this one. And if it doesn't count, we'll go straight onto the bank robbery. We've done enough challenges. Challenges are done. We're good. If we miss one, we miss one. And we'll just go straight into the bank robbery. I will need to get my honor down. So I have to do that. Meow, cat. My cat is coming to sit next to us. She's looking out the window at the moment. Boom shakalaka. It's those mushrooms, those chanterelles. That's what took most of the evening. Oh, just stop. No. No. You have to get down if you're going to be noisy. <laughs> Meow cat. Oh, man, it's been like three... Name your weapons in tall trees tonight. I think it's because I put it on the large. Right. Right, let's check. One left. This should be it. It says two out of three, so this should be the last one. Right, let's at least try, shall we? both those just watch those shots go above his head right where are you gonna be over here yes yeah, so here we go shit get up the rock Fucking brutal tribute guy. Come on. Come on. 
thing is, I don't see anybody else. We're all spread around. This is just just like single player deathmatch. Even though we're in a team. I can hear gunfire, but I can't. There, I don't know. Princely. <laughs> Struck by a tomahawk. That did. <laughs> Touche, man. I just saw you appear on the radar. I was like, who's that down there? And yeah. I spent too long reading the word blunt master. There. Where is he? He's right there. Oh, nice. Guy was just stood still, doing nothing. Blam. Gotcha. See that? That guy was right behind me. Oh, I thought I had that guy. I'm trying to use the trees as cover. I'm trying to use the trees as cover. I made quite a bit of money actually. I'm almost on 1,100. So you guys must have made at least $100 from. From deathmatch alone. Oh, behind me. Oh, Lee, right in the face. I've, I think I've been killed by every one of you tonight, actually. Campbell, Brinsley, and Lee have all killed me at least once. Okay, see the guy to the left. Get over the rocks. Shit! Shit! Oh fuck! Oh! Like, I had my gun leveled and then this shotgun blast just hit the side of my face. And I was, I was dead. He's right again! Brutal Truett is right again at the top. Man, he is. It's a horrible shot. I find that people who play deathmatch a lot, they're not very good at the free roam. Because they play they just play nothing but deathmatch. Oh shit, on fire. On fire. Who's that? Get this shotgun. Get the shotgun. Get the shotgun. No get the Yeah, just you hit left bumper and the computer goes. Oh, what was it who you were after again? You just wanted the shotgun, right? Sorry. Oh. Top of my hook. Yeah. <laughs> when you're using a close combat weapon and somebody else is using a shotgun. Oh, so I can go inside the house. This one. This guy. Here we go, here we go. He's here. There he is. There he is. Gotcha. Where are you, fucker? I reload. Fuck 
didn't you? Could have had that guy. Could have had that guy. Where am I? Six. Nice. Captain No Show and Captain Wolf. Looks like a plan. Walk between the two captains. Where, where are you? I need to kill something for the end. Last 20 seconds. If I'd fucking shot him, I'd have been happy. <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> Alright, that should count. It should pop up at any point now. It should pop up. Right now. Now. Nope. Okay. Alright. Then we come out and we go to the bank robberies. It's this guy. I reckon this guy's glitching the game. He's lagging. Right. I'm gonna come back out. Get into free roam. Find the nearest old man to change myself to dishonorable and then head to the bank. Shouldn't be too difficult. So dark and quiet outside. It's so weird because obviously we're so I'm so used to playing during the day. And when I'm playing in the evening and it's getting late, I'm like, oh gotta be quiet. You know, neighbours, children. It's supposed to be the best time to be on as well. Come on, game. There we go. Alright. Quit now, taking the party with me. I just seem to end up running around trying to find people on that map. Yeah, that's the same with me, Lee. You know, you really have to use your headphones or the sound to listen to the gunfire so you can head to it. I, I actually particularly don't like that map. Right. Where's the nearest old man? Old man, he's over there. Armadillo. Right, okay, so if I head to Armadillo. Right, what I'm going to do, boys, I'm going to head to Armadillo. I'm going to head to Armadillo, hit the old man, and then I'm going to take us to the bank robber. Armadillo. When you play in the mornings, I'm usually eating dinner. <clears throat> Australian dinner. It's just usually barbecue, isn't it? It's a barbie on the beach. That's all you eat is barbie on the beach. Like, you don't have to lie. We know. Um, where are you? You old man. There he is. Old man Jones. Like, it must be strange, you know, being in Australia, because you have constant sunshine. Like, it must be strange. Like, over here, we are we are constantly wet, so when we have sunshine, it's like, it's a shock. Like, is it ever shocking to you guys if you, like, have a okay, week's worth of rain? So you're here and you're... Oh, no. oh, no. You're wanting hell in a hand, Yeah, basket, I am. Huh? Is that it? So let me get this straight. You're bored with being halfway yep. decent. You want to be entirely yep, I awful. Be awful. And you need my help. Give me strength. <laughs> it's shameful. We can't even teach people imagination enough to sin right. Shame on us. Shame on us all. I'm paying your crap out of crap out, but who am I, who to, am I to judge? judge? Go forth 
and be a total nightmare for all and sundry. Now, good luck Thanks. to you. Just don't take up painting. <laughs> a little joke of mine. Uh, okay. Don't take up painting, ladies and gentlemen. Right. <clears throat> okay. On the level decreased. Head into progress. Story mission. Banks don't rob themselves. I'm hoping you're all ready because <clears throat> I didn't even wait for you. I was already hitting the button. Some days are below 12 Celsius. Wow. Like I don't know temperature, so that must be cold. But they're not freezing, obviously. So we're probably just looking at a bit of wind. Start mission. Four of us go. Let's rob this bank. I'm not riding. I'm not driving. Somebody else can drive. Actually, while I while the cut sequence is playing, I will pop the little boy here. So I'm readying up. Everybody else ready up? I popped the little boy here while we're already up. Now, if I'm right, we should be all set. And listen, usually I am right. Well, not always. Otherwise, I'll be doing this with my so-called best friend. Instead of thinking about what he did to me and the fact that we killed him, only banks don't rob themselves. So let's get ready. You can go get changed behind the gallows there. And by the and way, poorly came by. I said you was acquitting yourselves. Acquitting ourselves. Well, well, well. Don't we all look smart? You certainly looked the part. Oh, hey, Aaron Blake. Bank manager uh, what are you and Gary you hoping to review next time off the show? Like that, and he'll think you're from the Express um, Company. And that well, you're riding to the anything vault. that's on our priority list, happening. actually. You blow the safes or crack them if you don't want to make a noise. Like, we Enter have taken the choices. And um, run to meet me back there in the cemetery. But then again, like... Oh, the, and the, one the, more the, thing. The, the manager keeps donation, the bond obviously, the, do the we'll donation request. They come first. <laughs> Um, it's just like series of films, I suppose you want to do. Like we do want to do Return of the Living Dead series at some point. Um, don't know when. So we've got Lee and Brinsley driving. Eh? This should be interesting. <laughs> Didn't think it was going to work. Express round. Did they crash? He crashed, didn't he? Who, 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 who did he crash? Look, I've still got my bow and arrow on Shit. I Put the guns away. Put guns away, Campbell. We're going to need them in the, uh... She saw nothing. I saw somebody crash. I don't know who. Somebody will. Somebody crash. Alright. 
Hey, good afternoon, sir. We're here for the packages. Oh, the Express Company. I was expecting you a little later. Yeah. No matter. Let me escort You're you to okay. the vault. Of course, our security protocols won't allow me to take you all in. So, if some of you wouldn't mind waiting Boys, out here... Boys, just make yourself comfortable. Let me get this open for you. Uh, okay, don't look I'll now. Look. You good there? You know, you have gone the combination. <laughs> okay, okay. There you are. Thanks. We're just gonna let ourselves in, shall we? Come in. I believe the allocation request was for the regular amount. I got him? Darn. You got him. <laughs> we'll just help ourselves, you know. Okay. The click. There we go. And then this way. Wait for the click. Last one up. Come on. Where are you? You're usually right here. There you go. There you go. I'm getting good at that. It's taking me a while. Pick up the bones. Okay, I got the bones. No. Seems like somebody's making friends look wrong for fun. Friends, late. try not to kill the horses, please. We need them to escape. Everybody in the stagecoach, because you will get shot. Time to go, boys. Let's go. Well, that went quite well, I think. You know? Like, you know, we're all still alive. Here we go. Ready? Here they are. Shoot the horses! Four, four horses. Oh, shit. Brings the first. What a surprise. Skipping it. I like that. I like that. Okay. Remember, this corridor is corridor of death. So, pick your targets. Do not get drawn out. I don't want to be the one standing around at the door. You made some noise, all right. You got okay, the I got the front. Campbell, you got the left. Cover up here. We can hold them Lee, you got the right. Way out of here. Catch your breath. I'd hazard this ain't over yet. Put him to sleep for good. Here you we ready? come. We got one coming on here the goes. right. Two coming on the right. One coming. Two coming on the left. Keep fighting, okay? I got three on my side. Come on, somebody hit this fool already. Shit. Messy. Uh. 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 Uh.
train. That's a train. Time to go, boys. The tracks are gestured and slum. If we get there soon, there's a ride out of here. Who's that? Who do we need in mind? Go, go, go. There. We'd have blown his ass. I'm joking. Way. Here's where we go our separate ways, and remember All each four other. of us would have been like, click, click, blah, 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 blah. Bits would have just gone everywhere. Right, I suppose I best get ready to come off. Wow, 25 past 11. That is late. I gotta get up for work tomorrow. Yeah, Brinsley, fist bump. Shame we didn't get all our challenges done, but like I said, the server has been a bit weird this evening. Between not logging on. Smash Legends, hi in, hey Smashed. You're just about to join us, we're just about to sign off. <laughs> but then you can go back and watch it. Yeah. Gotta get our beauty sleep now. We could have a quick fight, Brinsley. We, the four of us are on, so I'm just about to check if I can get it to work, actually. Obviously, I'm not gonna say it's going to work. Hey, get your weapons ready. Here it goes. <laughs> oh shit. It's about to kick off. <laughs> nice, Campbell. Good way to start it, Campbell. Hasn't even started. He's just started lobbing dialogue. Here we go. Oh, Take this as a face leap. I need to still go buy my ancient tomahawk. Still haven't bought my ancient tomahawk yet. Oh shit! Ah! Oh shit, yeah, I'm gonna throw a knife. Artax, did they kill you? Somebody killed you. Oh man, I just got there. Fucking just got there and somebody killed Artax. That's not fair. Nice shot, Lee. That was a good shot. It's a fight. It is a, it's a, it's a bandito fight. Okay. 
good. I just killed everybody. <laughs> good shot, Bloodmaster. Good shot. <laughs> it's just. I was taking the time to just chill. You know? Taking the moment and then plow right in the face. Alright, where are you? Oh, who's this? Machete? Oh, missed! Oh. You're getting this one. You're getting this one, Bloodmaster. You know you are. You're getting this one. No, you're not. Oh, I got shot. Campbell fucking shot me. You didn't kill me, Brinsley. Campbell shot me. I should do more help. I'm not worried about it, actually. and throw knives at deadly. Oh. oh yes! Get it. Oh, he's gonna go back for the machete kill. He's going back for the machete. Oh! He's gonna get me! Come here! Come here you little bastard! Come here! <sighs> Don't you run from me Lee! Don't you <laughs> change his pump action? I should just show you the back. <sighs> well, in the last 30 seconds, I want to thank everybody for joining me this evening. It has been most fun. We will be um, hopefully back on again tomorrow morning. Um, um, for some more challenges, um, obviously I'm like five, six days away from a hundred days, so that is exciting. I hope you all have a good evening, good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are. Take it easy. Try not to get yourself into too much trouble. I mean, like these guys, they're just oh, Brin Brinsley, you just made that num round number ten. Thank you very much. Ah! <laughs> Thank you to everybody. Ah! <laughs> no, but you get away. We get away. Want to say? No, other one. There we go. Cheers, guys, for watching. Take it easy. I'll see you next time. <laughs> <laughs>